no, 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 no! I'd say every picture you can find of her, she's got gloves. I think he's very lucky if he survives this. I'm out! Albert Einstein. Tarzan. Enya. Say again. Oh, no, I can't have him because he's completely made out of gold. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. And well, look, I'm going to shout treat out the window for a bit. Oh. I mean, I haven't yeah. got a dog, but I suppose I can do that as well. Treat. 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 It works. Well, I've got red wine, as is my sort of... Um, what have I? Tonight? I look a bit like, would you believe it? Horn on wine. You don't see this every day. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no more words. Ah, problems. That you can find in the surname or Christian name that are yellow. Name another. Greg Lamond. Egg. Lemon, you bastard. <laughs> egg. <laughs> You're not the biggest eater of eggs I've ever met in my life, or? But there we are. No, am I? I don't like them, and so I've never eaten an egg. But you've eaten, if I did, it'd be yellow. You've, what? You've, you've eaten one. In a in a cake or in a... No, I don't like eggs, so I won't order an egg cake. I'll order a chocolate cake or a birthday cake. Yeah, but. The egg would be mixed in. Yeah. There'd be an egg in the cake. They'll mix in some secret eggs. They'll get me that way. They're not secret, they're just... Rach would have given you an egg. Why would you bring Rach into it? She knows. I don't like eggs, so I wouldn't eat them. But she'll bake with eggs. What? Why would she bake with eggs? That's not a phrase. Oh, right. Bake with eggs isn't a phrase suddenly. This is a great conversation. You'd have had a poached egg. Yeah, I've had a poached egg. Yeah, there you go. You've had egg. Well, that, that's egg. Has that got egg in it? Yeah, yeah that's, that's egg. It's all egg. Challenge. Ah, what? Uh, is it? Simple as that. Nah, in, one, in one? In one? All, in, it, in it goes in one? Yep. Yeah. Shove it in. in, it. Shove it in, in. the letterbox. In the letterbox. In, in the letterbox. That was a bit like a COVID test by the end. Brrr. Oh. Well, it must be so chilly. Yeah, well, there's just all this snow all over me. Is it? Ah, it's gross, this stuff. <laughs> Have you tried eating it? I think the, I mean, the main thing is it's shaving foam, unfortunately. <laughs> I, thought it was, I thought it might have been fake snow, but it's just shaving foam. Yeah, it's shaving foam. I don't even... I, I have an electric razor, I don't even shave with foam. I had to buy some specialty for this. So will it gradually sort of turn to liquid over the game? I suppose we'll see over the next two hours. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. The pizzas we had were... That big? No, that, that big? When you do it, do you have your... Is your head in the middle of the two hands every time? Well, your, your head can't be in the middle of the two hands. Can? Yeah. I'm not going to move my hand now. I'm just going to move, move my thumb. I think I might sometimes say something is this big. No, absolutely, absolutely not. Well, I'll tell you what, you say you sometimes say that, I think you'll say it to Mark. Ask him how big the pizza is and then ask him why his head is directly in the middle of his hands. I think you're picking the wrong person to put his head directly in the middle of his hands. You think he'll do that anyway? Out of anyone, he's the most likely to do that. He could do that. He couldn't. What do you think about this guy? Do you want me to ask the question to me? Yep, are you ready for the question? Yeah, I think so. Mark, with your hands, show me how big the pizza was that you ate with Timmy. It was, I mean... <laughs> this sort, it's this sort of thing, yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Remember, we have one each. We have one each of them. Yeah. <laughs> Is it worth nibbling from the plant? Okay, okay, all right. I didn't mean actually eat the plant. Some of them are poisonous. (laughs) 
But they're not that poisonous. Well, how poisonous are they? Well, it takes, it takes a minute or two. Or two. By the way, you two. Don't, pronounce, don't pronounce the W in two. You shouldn't. No, you don't have to with the rule. All right. So you pronounce, do you pronounce it? Well, what do you do with 12? Uh, 12. Uh, Why are you pronouncing a W in one and not in two? Fucking crazy language. You like that one. You're, you're like, respect. This guy's on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to, I'm so not tedious. I'm not going to shut my mouth for the rest of the show. Oh, that's good news. Yeah, that's totally, that's totally brilliant. Another sip of Lil. <laughs> this is quite fun, isn't it? Have a gulp and don't tr- drink it without shutting your mouth. A lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, see, yeah, it's interesting, this. <laughs> this is what my mouth does as it's coming. <laughs> Doing that. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, you've got to avoid that. Can you shut your mouth? Mouth open. Come on, drink, drink up. He's gone. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I don't think so, really. The lure. Well, it's the lure. It's the lure. <laughs> oh, but your mouth wants to shut, doesn't it? Look hey, at you. What? Look at you two leaning in like absolute banjo. <laughs> Read the small print. Your mouth can't shut. <laughs> He's put a lot in. He's put a lot in. He's still going in. What? He just drinks it. (laughs) 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 No, it doesn't work because your mouth wants to shout because your mouth wants to drink it. (laughs) Oh dear me. Sorry, I forgot the game was you can shut your mouth but you have to nod loads. (laughs) Sorry, I forgot the game was you're nearly 50. <clears throat> Peter Shilton. Ah, oh, switcheroo. No more people who've got all the letters in the right order of one of the main swear words throughout their name. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking forward to the name another, I have to say. <laughs> Count Dracula. What? Count Dracula. Yeah, fair. Brilliant, brilliant. Can we clarify the main ones? Is it? Ah, uh, we know the main you know ones. We know the main ones, dog. Don't play dumb with me. But I'm hoping someone's going to get bollocks in there somewhere. Arsehole, bollocks, clit, fuck. <laughs> clit, as a swear word. It's not a swear word. <laughs> Hang on. What? How the fuck did I lose my job? <laughs> I wouldn't say it to my mum, probably, but... I'll tell you what, then. If that's not a swear word, Clint Eastwood's back in. <laughs> 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 Do we have any challenges, Watto? No, uh, I can't challenge it, mate. There's nothing wrong with that, I don't think. What time is your bath? Quarter to nine. nine. Quarter to nine? Yeah. In the morning? PM. What's the point of being clean now? Well, always clean. Try be. Try and be always clean. Better than being dirty now, isn't it? But was that your first wash of the day? Is your logic get dirtier and dirtier and dirtier all day and then wash it all off? Or is it stay dirty? And then be clean for bed. When is key dirty? When is key clean? When is key hurty? Do you know what I mean? When is key dirty? When is key clean? When is key dirty? Do you know I'm so keen? This guy, you see. I may as well just say it. What? You... <laughs> okay, bye. <gasps> Come on! Bam, 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 bam. I'll do it till you say a category. All right now. Boom, 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 boom,
I think that's my favourite moment of No More Jockeys ever. <laughs> Not the bookshelf. Don't look at the bookshelf. Never look at the bookshelf. But um, bum bum. Not, Not the, the bookshelf. Book Don't look at the bookshelf. Never look at the bookshelf. But um, bum bum. But um, bum bum. Oh yeah. But um, bum bum. Ah. Not the bookshelf. Don't look at the bookshelf. Never look at the bookshelf. But um, bum bum. bum, bum. bum. Emigration is my favourite thing. Emigration is my favourite king. Is that, oh, is that Johnny Clocks. I'll say that. I'll say this the day I die. No, you don't need to do that because Johnny Clocks is the man who rocks. Oh, oh. So yeah, pull it right down. <laughs> pull it right down till the rim breaks off. Pull it right down till the rim the breaks, breaks off. off. Pull it right the, down to the rim, the rim breaks, breaks off. off. Pull it right down to the rim breaks off. I think Johnny my head's going to fall off first. Sorry, well, Johnny pull it Cox right. is the man who rocks. Now pull it right down to the rim. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Flamingo. Oh, yeah, you can't have Alan Flamingo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Naughty, but nice. One plate of fajitas, but another bowl of rice. I'm being naughty, but nice. I oh, yeah. I cuisines. Sometimes I'm a king and sometimes a queen. Come on. Naughty, yeah. but nice. Naughty, naughty but, but nice. Naughty. I'm eating hot food, but I'm crumbling over some ice. How many times is Pelosi married? How many times? Please tell me, old friend. How many times is Pelosi married? How many times? And then this game can end. Oh, I've yeah. got wrinkles on my forehead, I've got wrinkles on my temple. Wrinkles on my forehead, I've got wrinkles on my temple. Thanks, Mark. And Tim. Well, you didn't enjoy it. Boop, boop, unicorn mug. Boop, boop, unicorn mug. Okay. Boop, got a unicorn mug, a unicorn mug today. Oh, boop. boop unicorn mug. Unicorn mug. Unicorn mug. Boop, boop. Unicorn mug. <laughs> oh no, can't do that. Right, let's go to that first pose though, because I've got a little song. So oh, yeah. interlock your hands again and then bend it up. Now the other way. My hands look like mountains. My hands look like mountains. <laughs> Jack Spratt. What's on your underpants? What's on, on your, your underpants? White. Uh, have you had a drink? <laughs> Does a spider have a heart? Does a spider have a soul? Does a spider have a purpose? Does a spider have a goal? Hi, hi. I've made millions out of that since I uh, came to. Can you sniff your phone through an envelope? Can you sniff your phone through an envelope? You'd have to be a very sensitive bloke to sniff your phone through an envelope. Oh, can you sniff your phone through an envelope? Yeah, can you sniff your phone through an envelope? Well, you have to be a very sensitive bloke to sniff your phone through an envelope. Ah, yeah, sorry, yeah. Who do you get at Christmas? Who do you get at Christmas? Oh, I went mad there. <sighs> okay. Who do you get at Christmas? I said, who do you get at Christmas time? I want to know who do you get at Christmas, sir? Who do you get at Christmas time? Well, who do you get around Christmas time? <laughs> You get a wise man, you get a Mary, you get a Jesus Christ and a Santa Claus. You well, man, you get a fairy, you get a little old angel and Noah and Moses. A fairy? You get a Christmas. <laughs> my chin, my nose, my cheek. Tim turn. My eye, my brow, my cheek. Mark's turn. <laughs> my hair, my chest, my dick. Alex's turn. No, no, that's it, no. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, right, right, we're done, we're done. We're good.
All together now. Go on. One, two, two, three. <laughs> Ah, my chin, my nose, my cheek. <laughs> Tim's turn. My eye, my brow, and my cheek. And Mark's turn. <laughs> well, <laughs> my nose, my knee, my cough. <laughs> I changed it. <laughs> and my dad got mistaken for. Oh. Rolf Harris. Well, my dad got me mistaken for Rolf Harris. Harris. At the airport, they <laughs> were shouting, <laughs> Rolf! Oh. I'm going to go for... Ah! <laughs> I think it may be a case of... Um... They were shouting. <laughs> At the airport, they were shouting. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. I've killed lots of you. The current set is three to key, nothing to us. So, important game. Key to play. Oh, yeah. Join Armour Trading. Ah. First timer, debut. Debut. Oh, someone's just stolen your bear. Someone's just stolen your bear. My bear's wandered yeah. to the kitchen. My bear fucking hates this game. No more people whose surname could maybe be the answer uh, to the question, what are you doing? <laughs> right. Now, can I ask quite a lot of them? Um, <laughs> does that just mean no surnames with an ing on the end? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but she's the best one, isn't she? Well, yeah, name but, another. You know, cook, someone cooking? Yeah, but who? Uh, uh, yeah, well, John cooking. <laughs> oh, well, I'm thinking of that. I'm not thinking of people. <laughs> Have you got one? No. I think that's the curry. I think that's the curry. Uh, Dominic it, Cummings? Yeah, but it's got the S. And no one... Oh, what's he doing? He's, he's coming. You're joking. Well, armour trading. And, I mean, are you saying that she... Is, is the armour mean I'm trading? Yeah, both. It either means armour trading. Yeah. Or it means trading armor. Like swapping arms with someone. Um, no, I think you might be out, mate. Oh, winning? Matt Winnings? Matt Winnings, no. Because of the S? Yeah. What's that guy called? Sh sh the pianist? Shopping? <laughs> Shopper. <laughs> oh, I've got an easy one that we all know. Is that the one you're thinking of? Probably. Should I do an impression of him with my face? Yeah. Well, I don't know, because my one, the one I think of is, well, I'll do an, I'll do an impression of, of her with my face, but it's this sort of thing. Well, mine's a bit like that, but mine's more like this. Oh, okay, but mine is more like... Yeah. Well, mine's a bit sort of like, uh... Oh, I like your cake. Oh, mm. Noel Fielding! That's my oh, one, yeah. Right. Yeah, and mine, well, I won't say mine just in case. Well, in case, in case I accidentally say it in my second guess. Yeah, because it wouldn't amaze me. Yeah. <laughs> I, know what you're, I know what you can be like. I'm yeah, I know you... what I, I, I could be three nil up. I could be a bit like that. L no yeah. battery. Oh, oh, that's good news. This could be a problem. Uh, I might have, have got, to do this. Have you got any double A's or anything? Okay, that might help a bit. I mean, I'm looking at the wrong bit now. <laughs> Why don't you tease him for having London battery problems? Well... I don't know whether I'm luring or not. Maybe I am. Oh, maybe I am. I don't know, but maybe <laughs> I am. That's one of the best impressions of Key I've seen. <laughs> I just don't know if I'm luring or not. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I, am. I am. Still, we'll let Key look, look at his... Um, I don't think the definition of job's going to help you, because there's, there's millions of definitions, and one of them definitely purpose. Or, or vocation and that but, sort of thing. I'd say, what's the job of a fork? You don't get paid to put the food in your mouth. <laughs> well, I think lots of things have jobs. Lots of things have jobs you don't get paid for. <laughs> you do odd jobs around the house. You don't get paid for them, but you put, put your gloves on. <laughs> Why are you taking your cloak off and your hat? I know. I'm going to become a fork. <laughs> Still puts bread on the table, doesn't it? This is close. This is even for us, this is so <laughs> The Loch Ness Monster. Your friend of mine. Vanessa? No, not 
not the Nessie from the cartoon, the actual Loch Ness Monster. The, what do you mean, actual Loch Ness Monster? <laughs> Fuck me. You know, like the actual Bigfoot. The one in the, sight, the sighting, you know, that guy. <laughs> Horn's been very, very interesting tonight at times. Horn's been very thick tonight. What, that was an, that's an upside down welly, you moron. <laughs> My middle finger, every time I bend it, it makes a little crack, but then doesn't for 10 minutes. Do you want me to do it? I don't know, but all right, yeah. Ooh. But then it won't. But 10 minutes time, I'll do it again, and it will. I think I might look the most like Hugh Hefner at the moment. Yeah, for sure you do. I look the least like him. But these wouldn't be cushions if I was Hugh. These would be women. Yeah. <laughs> and those wouldn't be baubles on the tree next to Tim. They'd be women. <laughs> and it wouldn't be a tree, it'd be another woman. <laughs> yeah. And by the way, those wouldn't be books on those shelves behind you, what I maybe women. <laughs> yeah, they wouldn't be shelves either. <laughs> be more women. <laughs> your time is up. It's time for your first click. Ah. Did we lose the game? This is Buckinghamshire Broadband. I'm changing my name to it. <laughs> I've not seen him like this for a long while. He's not. He's just texted us saying, not sure what to do. Well, stop being in jail, maybe? Ah, no, here comes Horn on his iPhone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, Horn. yeah, none of this is recording. Oh, it no. does say recording at the top. Yeah, right. that's because sometimes I'm uh, more than just a pretty face. <laughs> are, you recording, are you recording this? Uh, as in, am I not a horse? Yeah, I pressed record when you left. Whoa. Do we just carry on with me on my telephone? Well, I've got a phone usually these days. You know, last four or five years we've uh, stopped saying telephone, really. You've got Buckinghamshire broadband. You really have. That's the absolute least of it. You mean... Well, what I might do is I might prop my old, uh, my phone up. Prop these up, please. There we go. That's back to normal, then. Well, it's yeah. Worse. Yeah, you definitely haven't frozen. This is fucking amateur hour. I don't think I've frozen. No, no, of course not. You're moving around loads. <laughs> well, I'm just sitting still, am I? You're, move, you're moving really smoothly rather than waiting for a bit and then moving all at once. Should I put, should I put my Wi-Fi on on my phone? Certainly what, the more, the more little changes you're making, the better it gets. <laughs> I think this show might get nominated for some awards, actually, because it's so good. <laughs> Have you ever recorded a Zoom before? No. So at the end, don't shut your lid. That's a good point, actually. I'll take advice from you. You seem to be on top of things. I can hear all this, even though I'm on my phone. <laughs> oh, it's good that you can hear it. You might be the join of the game. Did you misunderstood the... I think I misunderstood it. I thought it had to be the whole thing. But the, there's a verb in there, all right. Jam. Oh, that was the cookie cutter. <laughs> the cookie cutter. No, then, then actually, that's absolutely fine. <laughs> I'm holding my hands up, and I think I'm saying fair play, actually. All right. Well, well, I'm holding my hands up, and I think I'm saying I'm taking this down for both of us. Well, but you don't want me to this time. No, I don't know what I want now. That I, I mean, I'm at. Well, you could at least say I don't think he's a. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just give you a hint of it. What are you thinking? What's going in? Hmm. Mustard. Mustard. It's clear liquid. Oh, hang on. Is something actually going in? I can't see. Yeah. Do you want me to do it on my head? Yeah. Can you see it now? No. Well, ah. <laughs> ah. Ah. Is it vinegar? Ah. Is it vinegar? <laughs> what? No. Ah. It was vinegar. It was vinegar. It's distilled vinegar. Ah. <laughs> ah. Ah. <laughs> It's got Buckinghamshire eyes. <laughs> oh, that's my towel. Put that down. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay, come on. Okay. <laughs> Play Renny Zellweger. I can't find the song when it is all wigger on Spotify. I don't mind it so far. 
I'll, I'll just check in case you don't understand you. Play René Zellweger. Playing songs by René Zellweger from... Oh, I She's not sung anything yet, does that matter? <laughs> okay, so we've got some things to talk about. We have, yeah. My snack. Popcorn. Marshmallows. <laughs> Two eggs, milk, butter, borsan, salt and pepper in the microwave for a minute and a half. I thought you said you couldn't cook. <laughs> I thought you said you shouldn't cook. It's nice. You're an idiot. You're a COVID idiot. At least, ah. at least I'm not boring. I, I love Christmas with us guys. A little Christmas. So what's, it, what's it called, Horn? You were about to say the name of your fucking feces now. Christmas eggs. It's terrible stuff. I'm going to go for the witch of the wicked witch of the West. No more fictionalist. That was horrible. Yeah, that's that's a crap snack from a tedious O. Tim, have you got an Alexa? <laughs> What's an Alexa? <laughs> now we're talking. Whoa, we've not oh. been in this lair before. No, we're talking. We're in a lair. Yeah, don't show the police sign, otherwise you get in trouble. <laughs> yes? Not my one. This <laughs> ridiculous. Yes? Play Renny Zellweger. <laughs> Is that the really long one? <laughs> yes! Again. We're going to have to dig in a bit here. <laughs> He's certainly poking some eyes into this pineapple. Like, there's nobody's just. <laughs> he's happy with his work, I have to say. <laughs> this must be what Rodan's space is like when he's doing his sculptures. <laughs> A nice sound, of it? <laughs> problems for Horn that he created himself there. Wow, well, problems for Horn and his beard on a shelf of sorts. <laughs> And it's a problems for horn, it's my favourite little elf. It's problems, it's problems, it's problems! For horn! <laughs>
Get the volume up. Yeah, oh. yeah, you look nice as well. Yeah, I've got a bom, 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 bom. chicken on your head. It's chicken on my head. Yeah. 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 That's a chicken. Yeah, because of Christmas. Yeah. yeah, and it's on your head because it's Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, so it's chicken on my head. Are you in front of your tree? Yeah, I'm in front of my tree. Yeah. I've taken ours down. Oh right, you got the picture up of it. Yeah, I got. I kept the picture of it, but I took the tree down. <laughs> does that? Does your t-shirt? Does it move when you talk? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I made it. Oh yeah. In lockdown. Oh right. Oh, is that part of your pottery stuff? Yeah, yeah. So it was clay, and then you had to put it in the kiln, and then you just um, just paint it. <laughs> yeah, but you have to keep painting it when you talk because it moves a bit. Yeah. Are there normally three of us? Mark Watson. Yeah. Is he coming tonight? I've not um, I've not heard anything to the contrary. Well, Rachel said he had a dance no. lesson. Pardon me? Apparently he's got a dance lesson, so he can't come. <laughs> Who said this? Rachel? Rachel said it. Not my Is... Rachel. Dinky Donk Rachel. Oh. oh. Hi, guys. Have you finished <laughs> the lesson? My dance lesson? Yeah. Yeah. You look nice. Christmas. Yes, it's Christmas. I've got a microphone, but it's a uh, cracker. Christmas cracker. Uh, you've got a chicken on your head. Me? Yeah. Christmas chi- no, no, you haven't got one on your head. Hold on. You got this- on your head. You've got a pink thing on your head. This wig. This is a Christmas wig. chicken. Yes, it's nature's chicken, the Christmas chicken. Double C's. Thank you and please. All right. Well, we've talked enough about me and Horn, I think, so last us a lifetime. I'd like to say this. Go on record. <laughs> Mark, you look nice. I'll put it this way. This garment goes down a long, long, long way. <laughs> you look like you could be very happily in hospital. Yeah. It's, it's, um, it has the look of a surgical gown, but the fun of Christmas, my children chose it. I'd say <laughs> even one more thing. I would say <laughs> even can. one more thing about the garment. It, yep. Your garment would look absolutely fine on your friend of mine, a lady. And I'll tell you what, these days, people wear all sorts of people wear all sorts of clothes and nobody minds. Yeah, that's what I said. Well, we're, living, we're also living in an era, it would probably wouldn't have escaped you two gentlemen, who've got half an eye on the news cycle. We're living in an era where all sorts of people eat all sorts of things. Actually, I'm not, you'll get no argument out of me. 2021. I saw a, I saw a policeman wearing a bikini eating a sandwich. I've also seen a policeman today, not like he wasn't eating or wearing anything unusual, but it shows what can happen. Well, I've seen someone who worked in IT wearing right. um, track, tracksuit bottoms and a um, crop top eating a yoghurt. Yeah, and that just, that shows what can happen. Anything underneath the dress, Mark? Nothing whatsoever, Alex. Ah, nothing except my genius. Yes, it's Christmas time and it's sexy fun and everything is more or less fine apart from the cancellation of all our work. Hi! <laughs> it's... Um, <laughs> So is your little chap just resting on one of your thighs? My The whereabouts of my little chap will become evident later in the game, Alex. Oh, oh chubby! <laughs> well. Oh, my little chap is in my... Um, I'm wearing um, briefs. Yep. And so that's all just sort of all, all done and dusted in there. And then it's jeans over the top. And then, um, you know, occasionally yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll get it out and sort of, you know... I've, Keep it sort of moving, but other than that, that's that's me for the evening. But when once you've got your jeans on and, and your pants and everything, it's it actually says done and dusted. If it comes out, it's your choice. It's not gonna happen by accident. It's your it's choice. Not, not for me to worry about anymore. It's not for you, it's in the lap of the gods now. And what do I love? What Christmas. do I love? Oh. Almost. Uh Taiwan. Oh ah. yeah, sorry, I forgot. Taiwan. And I suppose it's time for these friends. Oh, no, not yet, not yet. Ah, when is it? I oh, know 10 30, isn't it? 10.30, thank okay. you. Sorry. And alarm? finally... Yeah, set an alarm for the antlers. Set your, have you got a special antler alarm on your phone? Yes, yes. May I just finally um, yes. say... Pardon me, on. Just shush a minute. Sorry about this, Tim, but he's just setting his uh, antler alarm. Antler alarm set. Carry on. I just wanted to extend an enormous uh, hello to your friends of mine, the old um, 
uh, you know, <laughs> you know, the old, uh, the old gut punch. The old and fisherman's it, friends down there. Yeah. <laughs> It would be a very strange show if we didn't, as always, fulsomely acknowledge the... the Dolly Vegas Boys! Hello, They're Dolly Boys! Just wading around in shit down there. Well, it's um, good to have more support. I'd like to thank the one that sent me this uh, boop boop unicorn um, badge, but you can't see very well. That's but, um, fantastic. It's not too bad, is it? Yeah. Is there any way you could, um, because it doesn't really show up totally on your, I don't have to use it, but I will use the phrase nighty, but is there a way of putting your brooch, like shoving it in through your skin and one of your ribs maybe, or the top ribs or this thing, and seeing maybe whether that does anything? Well, you know me, the way to do that would be if I tried to put it on normally, I think. Yeah, probably. Oh, yeah. Um, Look, we might, oh, yeah, 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 now and again, it's the chicken. (laughs) I like the Christmas chicken, I must say. I'm looking forward to when I get my antlers on because those have got bells on, which... Uh, yeah. Well, you had it on for a second. I saw yeah, but a Alex quite rightly ruled that it was time to wait for the antler alarm. I'm saying £19 for the chicken. Nine. £19 for the chicken? Nah. Well, there's only one way of finding out, and that yep. is by checking on Amazon. Checking, checking on, on Amazon. Amazon. Like Delivered yesterday uh, when we found out the show was cancelled. Yep. Uh, we started to uh, take evasive action and put a live one on. This is uh, seven pounds. Well, have a guess. Uh, <laughs> seven pounds. Pounds still. I think what? seven pounds. Seven, I'm going no, nineteen. Nope. Uh, well, you've both had a very good guess there. Seven ninety-nine. Uh, it's seven. Seven pounds seventy-three. Ah, uh, oh, yeah. Longer. Nature's seven ninety-nine. Hmm. I tell you what, it's not the worst thing I've seen you have in your head, and I say it advisedly. Go on then. What was the worst thing you've seen on his head? Sort of one of his hairstyles. <laughs> one of his hairstyles? I he think you only, you only have one hairstyle. At a time, yeah, but you can have different ones historically. But actually, what that was was a bit of trash talk, and it's not really my. That's not really my tone. I'm no, most very affectionate to both of you. But it's well, you... thinking that one of his haircuts was worse than the chicken on his head. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I... You've slipped up there, matey, because <laughs> y- y- that's not cool, because I've only been very nice to you about your nighty, and you I would also extend my hand of warmth to your haircut. Well, yeah, so actually I feel very um, I feel very sheepish now because we've, we've only had the, the most cordial of r- relations, really, haven't we, over the 20 years? We've been pretty good, actually. We've been pretty solid. You've been pretty solid. You keep extending. I'm ready to play this game. Oh, oh, I don't know. Tim, you keep extending things. You extended a hello, and then you're extending a hand of warmth. Uh, yeah, so yeah. The first real sort of observation of the game, and it goes to horn. Uh, I'll tell you what I love, really love. Oh, great. Taiwan, actually. Taiwan. Yeah. Mm. What colours the heart? Get enough of the cunting country. <laughs> Well, I think they're all in bed by now. I think it's just us. I'd say that sometimes where it just slips out. But I yeah, I don't think that was just... That, that, that didn't feel very emotional. That's a yellow. Fine, Ooh. fine. So I can't swear again? Well, you can, but then you'll be sent off. Yeah, I don't want to be sent off. I want to play the game. Hmm. Oh. I'm expecting that. Uh, I've got... Uh, sorry, I've got two left, have I, Horn? Yeah, you've got two leftovers. Right, well, key to play, start. Yeah, key to start, we often say, don't we? Well, welcome one and all. And Are, you extending be... three? Are you extending the welcome? I think I might keep this one for just us three, just for That's now. Great. What do you mean, great? Well, I think you can overextend. Yeah, sometimes it's nice to keep the welcomes local. What are you drinking, Horn? Prime beef. <laughs> <laughs> You? Me? <laughs> Are you pleased that that uh, noise happened or not at the same time you talked? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pleased with everything. <laughs> I'm look- on the... Uh, I'm drinking um, prime beef. <laughs> what, what, are you, what are you on tonight? I, I can do it in two words. Distilled beef. Ooh. So we're all oh. having a beefy old beverage tonight, and uh, long may it continue. Well, I might, ex- yeah. Oh, I nearly extended my um my drink. 
Well, I'm going to extend my first person of the game. Right. Now, when you do your category, Tim, can you try to make it um, one that makes sort of sense and, and doesn't ruin it? Oh, here come the fun police. I don't like that at all, Al. Do you know what I mean, Tim? Here come the fun police. When I look at your name on Zoom, I keep thinking you're Tina Fey. No, but you, okay. you'd know. we'd know if it was her because she's never, it's always been Tim. I know, but I sometimes glance down and think, oh, maybe it is this time, but it's, yeah. No, 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 no it's always been Tim. Okay, I'm, I'm going to go for Yoko Ono. Do you know her, Hon? Yoko Ono. Yeah, I do know you. I know Yoko Ono. I've, I've really warmed to her over the course of the Disney sort of cartoon of the Beatles, whatever it is. How do you get Disney, by the way? Everyone's got, got Disney now. I haven't got Disney, I don't think. Practice. Okay, so go Yoko Ono. Oh, no. Yeah. Um, well, I guess no more people who, 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 who like... Don't say others now. Don't say others again. <laughs> No, oh, no, no, people no. don't know about others yet. Others no. have yet to come. Oh, it was others no. out. Oh, others is out, isn't it? I think we've had others. People know about well, others. How about I? Get, how about I say my category okay. and then we sort of decide whether or not I'm a disaster afterwards. Well, you started with I guess, which doesn't help. Well, no, I started actually by to be fair to myself, and I don't have one usually, but stammering. But I'm mm. going to go for Yoko Ono, and it's a it's a very 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 simple case of. No more people have got. <laughs> oh, no. Is that a yes or a no? Uh, oh, no. Pardon me? Carry on. Well, no. I said, okay. Yeah, I got it. I got it. No yeah, more yeah, car yeah. No more car names. No more car names. Yeah, no more, no, no more, no more names where, you know, you could roll out the O's and uh, you, you, got, you got your sort of starting point for a car. So four, four wheels? No four wheelers, yeah. No four wheelers. <laughs> No more people. You could turn them into a car by just grabbing their O's and basically right. placing everything on that. I've got questions yeah. as always. What about a Robin Reliant situation? <laughs> what? Just fewer well, than three O's. O's. You can still yeah. make a car with three O's. You can, yeah. No, and this no, is this problems. Got, no, this has got to be like an adult car. <laughs> right. No more people that you can make an adult car out of their name. Well, let's be. Let's make it. Let's make it as clear as we can, shall we? No more people who you can roll out the O's and you can make Daddy's car. Uh, name another? Excuse me? Oh, I just thought it'd be interesting to hear another one. I don't think Tim knows this rule. If somebody says name another, <laughs> you have to name another person. Well, actually, do you know what? Funny enough, do you know do you know that there might be someone called Toto Wolf? Well, if there is, then it's fine, isn't it? And it, also, if there isn't, it's fine, because, of course, no one gets eliminated on name another. It's just a gentlemanly way of demonstrating that the category has integrity. Hmm. Can I check well, something? Yeah. Uh, you want to play something again? Is it four and only four? Could you have five? And how are you building a car with five wheels? Well, you could. One of them could be a spare, can it? Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you have a spare. Sometimes you, you give your car a bit of a steer. There's there's places where you can put these things. So more than four O's, and you're in all sorts of trouble, basically. Yeah. But more okay. than four O's, and you're in bliss. You're okay. You're okay four, with more than four. Four or more. Four or more. But you're not okay with more than four. <laughs> I don't know, but my my, my point is. <laughs> Toto Wolf, I think Toto Wolf is the is the is, is the chap who in the Grand Prix, um, when when Mercedes weren't allowed to win it, he said to the race director, "This this isn't fair." The race director said, "It's called racing, Toto." And he had right. two O's in his wolf, as far as you're concerned, like Virginia Wolf. As far as I'm concerned, they always have two two O's in their wolves. But also, he's in motor racing, so he would have four wheels anyway. So he wouldn't yeah, be able to have access to a car. Yeah. Anyone... I, I do think we need. Anyone... To... I'm not Tim, ruling I... out people who've got access to a car. You're not. So if you've got access to a car, you're through. Oh, go and, go and stuff your, your, your fucking hooter into your beef, frying beef. Oh, that's his first That's his first whistle, isn't it? That makes well, me I'm glad, better, actually. Right? I'm glad, actually. And I'll take another one right now, you can't. Because to be fair... <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, my God. You send it off, I yeah? I'm like Harry Kane. You can't really send me off because I'm one of the founding fathers. Because you're important. I'm, I'm you're important to the game. I've got a red, well, red let's lid. Put that, let's put that second cunt down to experience because I, I, I lost my mind for a second. My main point here is that um, I think Toto Wolf is a fine name and other, and I think it's a case of, and I say this advisedly, the game is underway. Uh, so just to be absolutely clear... Is the game it, is underway! 
Yes, the game's underway, but is it? We're only only four O's are a problemo. More than four is fine. Fewer than four is fine. No, I think more than four is not fine. But it's so fine four and know. over is not fine. It's fine if you're a challenger. Well, I would just all as all as I would say is this: what so? Just be a bit careful. Okay, once you start getting into the sort of the channels of the O's, maybe take yeah. a look around and think it's well, a bit O heavy. Just don't have too many wheels in the name. There's plenty of names. Mm. I can think of names right, right off the top of my head. Lee Child, for example, I think your child. Absolutely the guy that... zero O's in the entire O's. He's hitchhiking. We're not counting, sorry, we're not counting E's as O's. I don't think well, you can. I, I think E's a separate letter. <laughs> Good he's luck separate driving. Letter. Good luck driving to Bath tomorrow with E's instead of O's on your car. Ooh, reckon, bit of a bumpy one, this, round, because all my wheels are E's. <laughs> I think you get round on E's. you get there. Yeah, small E's. What about your capital E's? Oh, has Lee got capital E's, has he? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he introduced himself as the E child. Uh, I don't, well, I don't look at your bookshelves, but and also I don't, don't have him on your bookshelf. And also, no. I love my wham. How about that yes, you I know you do. <laughs> okay, I've got it. I've got it. I've, I know the answer. Ah. There's the answer. Well, I have to wait till my go now, but I think I know who to play. Mm, I've thought someone who doesn't have four or more O's. Hmm. Well, it must be nearly your go, isn't it? <clears throat> There's just the, the small matter of Mark Watson to come. Oh, what a... Is that the order? Uh, I think we're going with that, actually. Yes, the traditional. Well... Just in the standard I... name, is it, Tim? Just the standard name? Pardon me? These O's. Oh right. What? What do you mean standard name? <laughs> we're, not, we're not extending the name, are we? I'm not. I'm not Alexander, am I? Oh right. Just a given name. Given name. Given name. Thank you, Mark. Just a bit of clarity. But what I will famous say is, famous name. Famous, I, famous name. But I do imagine that if there was a challenge that extended the name in such a way as it became a four O name, certainly there'd be a few sort of um, ears yeah. bricking up. Yeah. What? So, what? So, let's say this: If such a thing happens, we can have a discussion mm. and a, a warm debate. I've got to we go can... at ten forty. Well, I've got to go at thirty. I actually need to nip off at twenty-five past. So this will be my first and last go. And um, well, it, it's it's. it's 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 it's. First it's, of all, I'd like to I'd like to echo. Uh, Tim's good wishes to everybody watching down in the sort of snake pit of souls there, whether you're in uh, uh, Florence or Rome. Nowhere else. Well, those are the <laughs> two main places, yeah. And uh, I'd like to sort of uh, usher into the auditorium somebody who we've not exactly seen every week that we've been playing No More Jockeys. It well, could be... Do we see eye to eye with this person? Well, I... I... I think when you hear who this person is, you'll 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 have to make up your own mind about your relationship with him or her. But it is him, as far as I know. Could be they, I suppose. Uh, but I don't think it's likely he's changed his pronouns because this isn't what you'd call a real person. It's, and I'm just. I mean, there's absolutely no always to be seen here. So I'm. I don't think I'm departing the game in round one. Uh, but it's Wee Willy Winky. Wee Willy Winky. <laughs> it's it's oh. the old W squared. W cubed, is it? Three Ws. Yeah. W-W-W-W-W-W-W. That's his, that's his website, yeah. <laughs> no. No. www.www.com. Were you just checking yeah. for O's? No, I was just checking for whether or not Horn was making sense at this stage. I don't know if Horn has ever made sense, as a, but I do think Taskmaster's done well. Um, oh, Horn! I think I met a girl who had hair like that. Huh. And I've, as far as I can recollect, I think she was very nice. Yeah, so that I've been wearing a wig more. till now. This is my real hair. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's Go on the then. Biggest reveal of all time from Horn. <laughs> wee willy, wee willy, wee willy, winky. That was a sort of strange twenty seconds of your life and my life as well, really, and probably Horn's. I've got an eye injury. Yes, I know that. <laughs> um. Well, it's wee willy, winky, isn't it? And it sort of goes without saying, really. Um, we 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 were winky. Yeah, no more people who you when you think about it. By the way, this this, it, I mean, read this small print. When you think about them, 
you mostly get them at night. No more people who their main business, the thing that they're famous for, is mostly conducted at night. What? No more badgers? No more badgers. No more night owls. Mm. Interesting. It is quite interesting, I think. Yeah. No I think... more people. What, what's night these days? <laughs> yeah, interesting. Yeah, I've not heard of night either. Night is sort no, of, um... I've heard of... I've heard of night, smart boy. I'm, I'm saying, how would you define night? Define your terms, worm. Yeah, what is night? My name's Tim and your name's um, Alex and my name's Mark. And we're going to talk about the time when it's dark. Night is a funny <laughs> little idea where you think, that's strange, I'm sort of not here because I'm unconscious. I've gone to sleep for once in a while. I don't have to weep. Night is what I'm talking about. Night is the time, without any doubt, when the moon is out, when it's fucking weird. Night is a time when you still have a beard. Sorry, you did slip in a little F word. Totally, but I'm, I mean, that's not my fault I'm just quoting, like, I didn't make that up. That's just well-known lyrics. I think by night we mean... Hang on, whose lyrics is that? Well, yeah, mine. Um, I think... He's very nice. Uh, what, what I like... Well, listen. I love Thailand. What is the night? <laughs> I think it's... What it is, is... Oh, have you got a window you can shout that out of? Yeah, I have, yeah. Hang on. Go on, give it a, give it a yell. Horn, have you, have you got a window? <laughs> uh, actually, I think, that, I think this is the night now, so I think this is a sort of weird thing to do because people will just go, well, it's this, isn't it? Yeah, but it was a bit weird when they started singing during the clapping. Also, you know as well as I do, Tim, I'm, I'm right at the top of a hill here. I mean, there's going to be any number of people hear this. Well, I don't think this is going to roll down, is it, this, this yell? Also, does he live on top of a hill? I thought he lived in London. He does live in London, but he lives on top of a hill in London. He, ah. Does he? In a yeah. little shed? No, 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 he lives now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hope one of the lovely people watching is at the bottom of the hill and can shout back... <laughs> What night is? Well, uh, we'll we'll wait for the responses to roll in. But I, I, I think what I'm saying is, it is a difficult one because it doesn't necessarily have to be when people are asleep. Because old Winky operates while adults are still asleep, doesn't he? Winky's thing is to rat on children that are awake. Uh, well, what I say is that it, the most chilling thing that you've you've done so far is use the word operates with Wee Willy Winky. Well, that's what I think he does. He he's an operator. He operates. I think. So do I think. You know you know what I think night is sometimes? I'd love I to think, hear about it. <clears throat> I think it's midnight until daybreak. I honestly do think that about night. Interesting, because that would that would get you off the hook with some people, wouldn't it? But I reckon... what they mainly do, because, yeah. Well, look, I think we just carry on, don't we? I don't think it's midnight. I think he's nonsense saying it's midnight till... Well, well maybe, oh, maybe oh, dark is better. N no, more, no more people whose main metier... Uh, it takes place after dark. For example, yeah. I think dance players. You wouldn't have a dance player, would you? From now no, on. exactly. This is why I think it's an interesting category because there are people who you don't really think about it, but actually, if you were to drill down into it, you would start thinking, well, no, you mostly only see that <coughs> after dark. It's very, I mean, Winky's famous for it because the guy... Operates. It, well, yeah, exactly. His whole field of operation is to do with skulking around, checking on people's awakeness, but... Yeah. Do you think Winky would have much of a chance in, in, the, in today's society, or do you think he was lucky he was, he was doing, doing his stuff when he was doing it? I think maybe Winky had a time. <coughs> yeah, these days it's much easier to trap people. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Well, Very I interesting. think we can discussion a, a nice discussion, a warm debate about night time later. Hmm. I think there could well be a warm debate. I've partly... But I'd uh, like to go on record night time is midnight until dawn, and I might, I might lean on that later. I think it could be interesting. I think I, I partly uh, ushered that category in with an eye on it being the sort of thing that people might, um, that might spark debate, shall we say, because sometimes in No More Jockeys, part of the fun of it is our uh, little conversations, isn't it? I'm just checking with Tim, though. So half 11, you wouldn't say half 11 at night, you'd say half 11 in the afternoon. <laughs> in the late afternoon. <laughs> Aladdin. 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 I mean, yeah. He's done stuff at night, but he hadn't done his main stuff at night. Because he's a prince, was he? <laughs> he snuck around at night. But I went to watch Aladdin, and lots of it was during the day. <laughs> Aladdin. And I'd also like to extend a warm welcome ah. uh, to all the people in Florence and... Uh, was it Rome? It's Florence <laughs> and Rome are the two places where people are watching this from, yeah. 
normal people who famously rub things. Well, I've never heard such a clear case of name another, I don't think. Well, I haven't thought I don't I haven't thought of someone who named, who, who also rubs things. <laughs> well, I'm trying to think of one now, though. You and the eye of the storm, potato. <laughs> I wonder if snooker players rub the nib. Yeah, that. Yeah. Also, no, I think I think the, I think the snooker referee rubs the ball. Oh, yeah. Rub. I, I, and cricketers also rub the ball when they're about to bowl. Yeah, I think they rub. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying that no one else famously rubs things. I just thought that you didn't have anyone else in your head, so I thought it was time oh, to just tickle your ribs a bit. Yeah. I think. Uh, yeah, I'd say a fast bowler would. I don't think they. Do. I think they pull it. Yeah. Our spinners rub it, don't they? Or I, you could you could claim a, that a cricketer rubs a ball, and you wouldn't be miles off. I reckon we'll be surprised by we thinking, oh God, he did rub that um, wall. It's the great thing about no more jockeys, isn't it? A category seems innocuous, but then we're surprised by what happens. Oh, I'd love, I'd love for this guy to fall on um, rubbers. If you caught oh. him on a rubber, you'd be absolutely away with the fairies. I don't mind saying that. Who's, who's he talking about when he says this guy? Oh, this it, guy, you, you, Al, you. Oh, why, why do you want me to fall on rubbers? Because... I, I, I don't know why. That's the honest <laughs> truth of it. I don't know why, but I just would love it. There's no malice. It's just if somebody introduces a category... Yeah. And then goes down on their own category. People like yeah. that. People like that stuff. It's nothing personal. Huh? I'd just like to see you fucking yourself up your own Arnuzzi. That's all. It's funny when you say name another. From that point on, it's don't name another, isn't it? That's the that's what an irony. <clears throat> well, um, I've had a great morning and a great afternoon. Are you up the well, chickens? Are you up the chickens, Arnuzzi? Uh, I think I probably am. Yeah, I probably absolutely. <laughs> Squeeze the old H inside the old um, the old CA, and um, see where it gets he, you. He seems to be saluting. Let's put it that way. So your head, your head, sort of an egg coming out. Uh, yes, my head's sort of an egg. Well, um, well, I suppose I could get rid of those people, those people whose heads are sort of an egg. <laughs> Is it too early to go no more baldies? Well, I can. Hmm. We're not it's too early, far short of that at the time. I, I can sense, I can feel that in my water. Yeah, well, it's, it's still not night time, so you're all right. <laughs> no, night doesn't start for a bit, apparently. Oh, I think I've got one. Ah. He said. To Mark. The chicken glowering as per. <laughs> I think the chicken might be looking at your bookshelf. Ooh, don't, look at my, don't look at my book. Don't look at my <laughs> book. It's not worth a look. What an inquisitive chicken. <laughs> he can't well, stop looking at the bookshelf. Well, don't look he's, at the bookshelf. He's don't probably look looking at, the... at uh, Tim's book, which is on my bookshelf there, look. <laughs> he just keeps looking at the bookshelf. <laughs> don't look at the bookshelf. I don't know how uh, Rod Hull put up with Amy, because my, my guy's pretty docile, but <laughs> it's still a bit of a pain in the neck, him looking up there. But Rod yeah, Hull had like a him. terrible time. Oh, Amy was full of opinions and he had loads of his own ideas about what to do. Well, I think it's it's time for me to say, well, it's not it's not Amy, it's nature's Amy, I suppose, the ultimate Amy. Um, and that is uh well the well, I know you I know you are you're quite into his 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 uh you're his right work. There. <laughs> am I all right? I'm okay, I'm just wondering what he's <laughs> He, he, he wants me to play Joseph O'Neill. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, come on. Dominic Raab. Yeah, yeah. Dominic ah. Raab. It has to be Dominic Raab. Rather. I, I, and this isn't fact. I think he's watching. Somebody said he bought a ticket. Oh, well, that's, that would make sense. I know Alan Davis watched John Kearns the other day. Mm, I think Dominic oh, Raab watches this. Already. Now you're not going to get me on a technicality because uh, are you, are you are we thinking that he robs things as in like everything he does he's robbing, like like it, in the, this morning when he did all these interviews, we, would you say that's an example of him robbing things? His neighbours are saying that's classic robbing there. <laughs> he did rob the Today program today, <laughs> but it's different from robbing, isn't it, Horn? You must admit that. Well, I'm not saying if I'm challenging or not. I haven't asked oh. you to challenge it. Oh, can oh, you put? His Yeah, there they go. 
There you go. You've put your um, you've put your egg inside the the antlers on it. Precisely. Yeah. I put my eggs. Ten, ten, egg. ten more seconds, Mark. Ten more seconds, and off off they go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Might as well just see this out now. Bloody hellhorn! You're a t- you're a hard taskmaster. Yeah, isn't he? Is he ever? Well, I've had a lovely Sorry, day. Off they go, Mark. And good night, antlers. Uh, good night, Mark. I've had a lovely day in every way. One ninety nine. Those. Sorry, I count. And I have to say, to the gathered men, that Dominic Raab, and that is no more. Basically, no more people. Basically, who basically. <clears throat> Who, um, you, do you like him? Maybe we should do stuff like later on, we'll be doing this to encourage people to keep watching. Or like they do on telly when on the one show where they're like coming up later. Yeah, I think maybe. I'm just worried at how long the gap there's be- between Rob and a category. I don't know. I hope, okay, well, from now on, we'll do as soon as someone names um, a person, but before the category, one of us has to do a coming up, coming up later on. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> okay, well, this is, this is, um, uh, a very good country, Taiwan. Oh, Taiwan, what, Taiwan. Really nice place. But what I would say is, Dominic Raab, no more people who are, you know, um, they've, um, you know, they've been in the firing line. Um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Well, no, okay. No more people who've been, no more people who there's evidence that they've been grilled. Uh, you know, for... They've been grilled. They've been grilled by a yeah, journalist. They've been grilled by a journalist on live television for more than six minutes. <laughs> grilled, but not interviewed. They've been grilled. They're for in the more firing than line. Six minutes. Pardon me. More for more than six minutes. Yeah, I reckon more than. Well, what's the most he's ever been grilled? Do you think? No more people that have been the subject of a long, hostile interview. On television. Perfect. No more no more people have been grilled. And we I don't think count things like masterminds is not a grilling, is it? No, because that's what, what do you mean? They're not asking about your personal life or you know whether you whether or not you fucked up the pandemic. They're trying to get some answers out of you as to I've only what got was four going. whistles left in this. I don't want to use them all up. They're asking you uh questions about Chaucer's Canterbury Tales, and you're coming home with a massive great slab of glass, is what happens on Mastermind. That's not what we're talking about now. Okay. Not in one version of Mastermind. Horn is being answered, asked questions about, um, you, you know, Ken Dodd, Ken and he's Dodd. coming out with a big tail between his legs. He was second. Well, and I wasn't. Well, and I was. Actually, I was once. I played it twice. Second and first. Dominic Raab, no more people who've been grilled. Hmm. And is that a 90-second evidence situation? Oh, do 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 shut up, Horn. <laughs> no, oh, no, it right. is. It uh, is, uh, and actually, as I, I would say this as well, Horn. Good question. Later on, I'll be eating a snack for about 11, 11 15. Ah, okay. Right. Snack well. attack. Yeah, sorry, later on, snack attack. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't, go, don't go anywhere. <laughs> yeah, good. That's good <laughs> tactics, Horn. Later on, I'll be opening a printer cartridge. Don't go anywhere. Don't, let's not use up all of our... Okay, well, in that case, I won't mention what I'm going to do later on. Instead... Well, pardon me, was I? Oh, sorry. Instead... Instead... I've got a big um, ink stain on my foot. Now, where that's come from, I don't know. Is anyone's guess. How long has it been there, do you reckon? I saw it for the, the first sighting was today. Do you think I should get it checked out? Does it, is it painful? Yes. And is the ink stain blood? Well, it's red. Right. So your your foot's bleeding, I think. And there's a nail coming out. <laughs> and is the blood coming out from the nail or from the foot? I don't know. I've been a bit woozy ever since I was doing some DIY earlier. <laughs> On your foot? <laughs> yeah. I checked some websites. It said don't do it yourself, but I thought I'm doing it. <laughs> Well, um, well done, everyone. Whose go is it? Mark's. Oh, First, I, though. I sometimes say mine in that sort of situation. No, I, I say Mark. Know anything about the word mine? 
And also, it's time for a little game of kitchen conversions. Whoa. <laughs> oh, good, 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 good. Okay. Uh, so, Tim, 150 Celsius. What gas mark is that? Uh, I don't know. Okay. And Alex? Um, four ounces. How many grams is that? I don't know. And so, nil-nil after round one of kitchen conversions. I enjoyed that. Yeah, I enjoyed that. Kitchen conversions. I enjoyed it too. Well, people mm. enjoy it for a reason. It's a good game. Whoa! You... Kitchen conversions. Have we nearly finished, do you think? Yeah, I reckon we'll wrap it up now. This should be the last couple. Um, well. What do you get at Christmas? What do you get at Christmas? You get lovely old pudding and lots of jokes. You get conversations with awful blokes. What do you get at Christmas? And what do you get at Christmas time? You get England struggling despite Ben Stokes. Uh, and what do you get at Christmas? What do you get at Christmas time? You get Alec Jones, you get Turkey Bones, you get Delia Smith, you get a bit of a whiff of gravy. Yeah. At Christmas time. <laughs> <laughs> you get people called Jones, you get rotten old bones, you get lots and lots of people on loan to other families at Christmas time. Although be careful because of the restrictions. Right. I think it's Kate Bush, pretty obviously. Oh, but, but pretty obviously you do get people called Jones. Anyway, carry on. You always have done yours, well. <laughs> yeah. You get, people Jones, you, get around, you get a lot of people leaving the town at Christmas time. At um, Christmas time! At Christmas time! <laughs> you get people called Jones, you get people called Brown, and Hera was jealous of Jesus' crown at Christmas time. Oh, yeah. So I think... John. Oh, sorry, John. I think it's... Uh, well, yeah, it's it's it's... And I suppose there's a tiny Leah in this, but um, but I'd be so surprised if I, I, I'm I'm absolutely I don't want to see anyone go out at any point. You're a lovely, you're a lovely lad in a horrible world. I'll go on record as saying it. What I am is an LL in an HW, and that and I'll go on record as saying it and abbreviating it. Horns um, just a pillar in Chesham, but there we are. I don't know. It's, I don't not, know a it's, it's not a criticism. <laughs> I found some more. Aha! Ah. I'll have to get some more beef. More beef. More beef for me. Is it a category yet, or is it just no more Kate Bush? No, Kate Bush. So as it stands, it's just no more Kate Bush. But I think I can do better. I, th I think let's do it one at a time tonight. Is it? Just no. Just rule out one one person at a time. Well, it's certainly better value for money because it'll go on longer. Uh, Kate Bush. I don't know how many times I have to say it, really. Do you and get, it's sorry. When you get married, Tim, do you reckon you'll wear that at the at the ceremony? Quite big, big wear. Quite a big wear. <laughs> I said quite. I was actually kinder than you were. I, I, I might pull this out during my speech. <laughs> that that is that on the one proviso that my bride has got a good sense of humour. Mm. Well, the chicken is quite smart. That's what I'm thinking. The chicken's quite dressed up. Like it's it's weird that the chicken's not wearing an animal on, on his head. Yeah, the chicken looks wedding ready. Mm. I did actually Bloody start the proceedings with a jacket yeah. right before the show. I had a jacket on as well, but then I thought I'd take it off because it is a bit too, bit too formal. Yeah. Well, it's Kate Bush, and um, uh, yeah, familiar sort of uh, problem. Really, no more people. <sighs> We've had it before, and I don't think anyone liked it, and I don't think anyone likes it this time. But I'm, I can't do everything because people like it. No, it's no, you, no, you do not. You go because you think this is the way I need to play my game, my friends, my game, my friends, my game, my friends. You go because in your heart you're thinking about my game, my friends. Right. Well, no more surnames of American pres Presleys than presidents. Eek. No more Eek. sharing surnames with them. Um, Anyone that's held the, that's lived in the, um, not that's lived in the White House, but that's, you know. And in this case, of course, there's George Bush. Well, that's, I mean, that's only oh, after story. Sorry, Tim. And there's George W. Bush, his son. Uh, 
Well, that's put a real dampener on the game, Mark. Well, it, all it means is that you can't really have Judd Trump. But you can still have Jack Lizowski. Very oh. likely you will still have Jack Lizowski. Yes. <laughs> I was thinking um, earlier in the week. I, I know that's. I know we're still pretty early now. Do you want to say cast your mind back? Do you want to start with that? Would that help? No. Yeah, if you want to say that, you can, and we'll be supportive of it. Yeah, I think go for it. Uh, no, I don't think it would help in this context. Uh, no, Hercules. Bless your heart, on. I know you're, you're only trying to help me out. Hercules. Oh, yeah, Hercules. Carry on with your anecdote. Well, my anecdote is what I would quite like to do is get in touch with Jack and see if he could wear, you know, no more jockeys in one of his tournaments and we could, you know, give him some money. Stop rubbing yeah, so it. He wears it on his waistcoat and we get, we give him sort of 20 grand or something. I mean, ideally, we get 20 grand, but I think we have to pay him, don't we? I think so, yeah, because we get advertising off of it. <laughs> so actually, what we should be negotiating over is whether he wants to have the, the name Jack Lesowski on one of our clothes and then he pays us 20 grand. Well, we have advertised him quite a bit. I think we've... Yeah, to be fair, he's probably he owes us about 20 grand, yeah. Well, the trick is we need to find... Do you know him, Mark? Uh, no, but he's, he's not exactly Bristolian, is he? But he's certainly based in the West Country. Oh, he's, and... not a mid he's, he's more Bristolian than he is. Do you know what I mean? He's, he's not... Well, to be fair to the guy, French. No, I think I can probably get hold of Jack Lissaski. The question is, what happens then, really? <laughs> well, I suppose we sort of get him in a room and it's just the sort of three of us and him and just sort of see whether he likes the apps. I'm, 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 I don't want to come. Ah. Well, OK, then it's, it's, it's the two of us and him and then maybe we get another snooker player then. He probably want to bring some, you know, like when they when they hand over money and get the the guy back or the girl. Hercules. <laughs> no more people with ultra muscly bodies. Ah dear. There goes Mr. Motivator, just like that. It doesn't rule out my next one. Thank you very much, Horn. Yeah. No more people with ultra muscly bodies in the end. They've got to be well defined. Well defined. defined. All right. Well, um, that's fantastic. Coming up later in the show, I um, will have a crust of pizza and, you know, just, just see, see who salutes, really. But for now, I'm going to say someone who, certainly his reputation isn't really, um, it doesn't really precede him. What's the other one? I suppose his reputation sort of comes after him a bit. This Succeeds him, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be surprised if he's muscly. I mean, I don't know much about this guy, but it's Jimmy Riddle. <laughs> Isn't that just rhyming slang for going to the toilet? Going for a wee? Yes. Well, this is sort of my point, I think, of the category. <clears throat> no more people who don't exist, is it? No more people who don't, no, you, no. don't even get. It's, it's more, no more people who are more famous for their, for their, their, for their phrase than for, you know, their, their, the stuff they sort of get, got on with. Oh, I've got to name another. Right. Go on, then. Who's your name another? Well, well, Pete Tong, I suppose. You think Pete Tong's more famous for people saying it's all gone Pete Tong <laughs> than for everything he accomplished as Pete Tong? Well, I, mean, I don't think that's a good name another. I like the category. All right, like, then. Yeah. Uh, uh, um, Lady Luck. <laughs> <laughs> but that's a... Per that's a the, the... Wow. Oh, how, Jesus Christ? No. No, I uh, think I think he, he he made a real name for himself in other ways. What's up? What about like when you say, "Oh, uh, Gordon Bennett"? Yeah, yeah Gordon, Gordon Bennett. Bennett's not a bad one. <laughs> I said that the other day. Yeah, Gordon Bennett. Yeah, those sorts of things. You know, so I should be unlikely to go out on this. But yeah. <laughs> <didn't> really... <laughs> right. So the question is whether or not there was a Jimmy Riddle who did exist. And if that person falls foul of any of the categories, where do we want well, to take that risk? Well, I'll say I'll, I'll say this, you know, there's there's conjecture about it. That's a point. That's a point. There's there's conjecture about it. What do you mean there's conjecture about it? Well, I mean there's conjecture about it. What about whether Jimmy Riddle exists? No, yeah. Well there is a Jimmy Riddle, there's famous Jimmy Riddles, but Are there? The, well the, the, well, yeah, I mean there's like a musician called Jimmy Riddle. Hmm. What band are they in? Uh, bad, badly drawn, badly drawn boy. <laughs> 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 Go, 
I only know that because my dad plays in Badly Drawn Boy. My no, dad is um, the. Uh... <laughs> yeah, your dad plays the old uh... the drums, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and Badly Drawn Boy is definitely a band. <laughs> it is a band, isn't it, Badly Drawn Boy? Well, it's a gentleman called Damon Goff, really, but under an, under a, like a stage name. Mm. Oh right, okay. Is he sponsored? We can get him on board. I think Damon Goff is right. I might have had that wrong. If if I, if that's wrong, then already it'll be bubbling away below the old. Uh... I hope it's not wrong. Oh. <laughs> I forget sometimes how sort of your chicken likes to get get involved. Well, it doesn't usually. It's just looking at books. <laughs> I can't believe I can't believe the one hat I could get where he's looking at bookshelves. I mean staring at bookshelves. Absolutely. <laughs> like also every time I move he's just looking more at them. Oh yeah, there's nothing you can do. Is 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 the definition of someone that's looking a scam, I'm afraid. <laughs> Don't look at my bookshelves. Don't look at my bookshelves. At least you've got a song for this eventuality. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I've got a song ready for him. Don't look at my bookshelves. Don't look, look at my bookshelves. If, if you want to, you mustn't have a look. No, no. But no. I'm trying to remember the categories. If I'm honest. Ah, this is always a problem, isn't it? Always a problem. Always a problem. Never a cure. Sorry. Sure. Yeah, that's right. Like your company, don't like your hours. Hmm. Well, is it half time? Yeah, half time. Change like ends. Change ends. Change your hands. <coughs> hmm. <Right. coughs> I think it's your turn to kick off the second half, Mark. It is. I um I have the ball for the second half. And um sometimes I sort of do this, don't I? Ooh. And roll rub it up, roll, roll up round your tummy. Might as well. Yep, up it comes, up it comes. Oh. Yeah. Oh. There's loads of it. There's so much of it. I mean, it's unbelievable. <laughs> <Isn't that> <laughs> <laughs> you can't uh, actually you can't argue with anything. I genuinely do think that. Yeah. I've never seen anyone argue persuasively with anything, and I'll stand by that until the day I'm in my bloody box. Yeah. Until well, as soon also, as you start I, arguing, sorry, as soon as you start arguing, I'm out. Game's gone. Game's gone. You can't argue with stuff. I think it's true. It's not. Who? Oh. Oh. Oh, I thought you said King Kong when you said James gone. Game's gone. But you said game's gone. <laughs> I just joined in with King Kong. I thought that's what you were saying at that point. <laughs> well, yeah. if, you, if, if someone is saying something and you think you've got a fairly clear idea what it is, you should just say it, yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just repeat it. <laughs> That's how conversations work. Yeah. I've got an eye disease. Oh, uh, I've got an eye disease. Oh, I shouldn't have a pen, people. Would... No. <laughs> yeah, throw the pen. Go on then, what's there? Is it you? Pen's miles away. Uh, yeah, it is, isn't it? Well, it's definitely me. It's definitely me. Uh, it's just a question of now. Um... Yeah, go on. Well, I'm just trying to finalise a couple of things now. And actually, you might think this is unlikely, but the person I've just thought of, I, I, I um, could have got Chalons on. So it goes to show it's not, it's you, not know, you know. It's what you it's, know. It's, it's not yeah. who you know. It's not rocking horse science. Let's put, let's put it that way. We can put it that way. Um. Okay. Um. Okay. Yeah. Um. Well, hmm. 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 well, I th I think that probably the way to go is just to say Salvador Dali and then not sort of worry too much after that. Like after having said that, isn't it? Because a very, very, very interesting passage of play commences no i know i think will happen that's that's an advert for something later on isn't it oh will happen yeah. will happen in about 45 minutes huh. <laughs> do you bite stuff on christmas day yeah. you guys yeah yeah you too. yeah no, normally normally 
Yeah. Oh well, in the morning I'll buy a um, <clears throat> you know, crisps. Yeah. Yes. In the morning we all buy we all sort of just gnash some crisps, don't we? Yeah. Christmas. We'll have that orange juice and orange juice and champagne, isn't it? And then some crisps. Yeah, crisps. Crisps usually is one of the first things I buy on Christmas Day, and then um, <clears throat> well, much later I'm sort of jumping around it a bit, but I usually buy a um, cold roast roast chicken. Roast. Yeah. Roast. <laughs> you get the idea. A biting stuff. Always cold, though, isn't it? Yeah. Can you buy oh. soup? <laughs> bite soup. You, you, I, you, it, sometimes you get quite thick soups, don't you? Well, you sometimes yeah. get quite thick people, but you just have to get on with it. That's true. You have to just make the most of sort of yeah, Salvador Dali. It'd be nice to be soup, wouldn't it? Then no one could bite you. I yeah. Don't, I don't need to be soup, Paul. Yeah, that's the thing. If there's a snake, do they bite? They sting, don't they? But like, if there's like a, um, what is it, like a bear, then maybe the thing to do is just pray that you turn into soup. soup. A shark, maybe a shark attack. They're just getting a... You can't, oh, you can't just no, turn into soup at the drop of a hat. It's not. A... No, no, you, you oh. can't turn into soup if there's a shark attack because the soup would then, you know, dissipate around the ocean. But if you're in a <laughs> glade and a bear's coming towards you, you could go, look, make me soup, then you're soup. It can't bite you. Yeah. And then when the gone he might have taken he might have had a bit but we don't know well, what i was gonna say it'll be it'll be your superpower but then that sounds like i'm doing a joke but it, uh, it the, the last thing we want is is uh yeah, mm. but I think, yeah my superpower would be be able to become <laughs> soup quickly yes, my, <laughs> my my superpower would be be able, be able to become soup quickly and what then not you... remain soup for too long because i'm worried that somebody might drink me Forgot about that. <laughs> well, they're, well they're, only if they've got a spoon. My superpower, I just, I'd like to be able to open stuff. <laughs> uh, you opened the store, didn't you? Yeah, uh, yeah. I can open comedy clubs. That's, that's, it, that's it, though. Oh no, I meant Asda. Oh yes, I did open. I did open Asda in Beaconsfield. <laughs> um, that sounded a bit too much of a joke. I know, but occasionally we sort of throw him a bone, don't we, Dan, in the old... Uh... I don't think there is a Beaconsfield after. Right, well, Horn, thanks. You're, for... what, you're, you're one of a kind, Vaughn. Yeah, you're none of a kind. Well, Salvador Dali. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, yeah. No more people you can find a self-portrait of, of them. Does that include selfies? Oh, that's actually not as stupid as it sounds, is it? Because... I'm not a stupid person. I think it I, is as stupid as it sounds. Don't worry, Mark. It doesn't okay. include selfies. No, it must be a, uh, a a painting or drawing or artistic rendition of them. It can't. Well, but you're or right. Or just the thing with a camera phone, maybe. Yeah, so a selfie. What, what about that bit where I said I was I was not a stupid person and no one agreed? Well, I just, I just don't think we had enough time to agree. It wasn't about. Oh, I didn't have enough time. It wasn't about. You've had about, you've had about a minute now. Well, I okay. I don't think you're. I don't think you're a stupid. Person. I've not had no. enough time. You've published a couple of books, so one's up there and I've got it. I've actually got both of them. And I've got all of them. There's, there was one called The Incomplete Tim Key. Don't look don't look at your bookshelves. No, but if I do, I see quite a lot of you. And that's that <coughs> to me doesn't scream stupid person at, at all. At all. I'm tempted to challenge. But, no, but not not in a way to get you out, but just you know, we're approaching the hour mark. Yeah, I'll dig in, I think, because I definitely don't want to go out. I don't want anyone to go out for a bit. No, I don't want you to go out, but we also need some action in the yeah, game. Yeah, 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 of course we do. I mean do you mind if I lob a challenge in? No, it's part of the game. I, I, it will be the death of me when I do this a couple more times and then I'm out. That's the, again, that's part of the game. I wonder if Darley. I'll do a challenge that Darley did some famous rubbings. Mm. Like he might have sold that, some brass rubbings. That is lovely, Basmos. But you know what? Rubbings aren't that. A lot of the great artists didn't really sort of go across I know, the, I just think, r- rubbings there of the office. But have a look here and just see if Darley did some rubbings. I suppose actually that's fair. He probably did do some rubbings, but I probably, what I'll do is I'll top up my drink and I don't think I'll necessarily. No, well, no, don't go, don't go. Yeah, don't no. go. Find out if you get some famous rubbings. Salvador Dali only did brass rubbings. Well, I mean, you're living in La La Land if you think he only did brass. He did stuff where there's sort of clocks melting off a bloody um, wall well, into a. Dead... Maybe they, maybe he rubbed them. 
Maybe he rubbed them out. He probably did loads of rubbing with an eraser. Yeah, I think he probably rubbed as much as he didn't rub. Well, <laughs> yeah, it's good. Oh, I tell you what, Salvador Dali rubbing alcohol is um, is coming up. Uh, he, I think he might have unfortunately been addicted to, uh, to rubbing alcohol. <laughs> uh, but I don't think that's, well. <laughs> what, is that the now, thing where you rub it all the time and that's the main thing he did, was it? Uh, well, let's have a look. Um, it wasn't a great. There's, there's some facts about Dali. It wasn't a great student. Don't just uh, go through facts about that. Can't mean how you're doing the work. He made himself hallucinate. Um, one of the ways he would do this is to stare at a fixed object and try to see something different within it. Oh, like a magic eye. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he was obsessed with Sigmund Freud. Um, one second. One second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Um, um, I'm on fact six. Um, he worked with Alfred Hitchcock. He worked with Walt Disney. He loved cauliflower. <laughs> he had a marriage. <clears throat> he appeared on game shows. He used the he same quite a life, actually. He was on Catchphrase, wasn't he? Yeah. Uh, his um, moustache. Um, he yeah, wasn't he above was. commercial. But Probably rubbed his moustache quite a bit, didn't he? He designed swimwear. It's famously rubbed things. That's the thing. And I don't think that if you have to go this deep into his biography... It's... No, not if you're on fact nine. He published a cookbook. Published a novel. We've all published a cookbook and a novel. Built his own museum. We've all well, done no, I, I, I don't think he should go. But also, I'm not a massive fan of the style of work, Key. A lot of people criticise key style of work, but I know he's got a different type of... He's got mm. lame functions or whatever it is on his phone. Yeah, it's just whether or not he used the word rubbing in any point in the research. Well, um, well, yes, <laughs> I did. Rub, rubbing alcohol. Ah, now then. Um... Well, all of the stuff, the problem with rub, when you type in rubbing alcohol is all the answers come up and they've got rubbing alcohol crossed out. Yeah, which almost suggests that he, he wasn't a sort of enormous addict of... Um... Also, I don't know I don't know how much I love the phrase rubbing alcohol, really. <laughs> I, I've definitely never heard it before. Uh, well, no, is he... The phrase is like, uh, it's absolutely fine. <laughs> he used to, to... He used to... Oh. Bath salts, meth, heroin. <laughs> how are you pronouncing it? Is it heroin? Is it heroin? Heroin. The thing is, I, I think bath salts is something that quite a lot of people do. This is a different website. This is what people are saying they like. Yeah, I, I, yeah well, I'm, really... I'm quite keen that you stop now. I think well, keen I have... work. Oh. <coughs> I've stopped. Well, I've look, stopped. I, I'm walking. Well, do you believe it? The first time someone's walked because, but you, I think you're right to do it. I think you're right to do it. Someone walking because of someone else's work. People really. If it comes to something. Okay. <laughs> Well, that was an in, that was that was that was maybe my most intense moment of my year. Me too. I'm tempted. I, it's my go, is it now? Yeah. Well, I'm tempted, but I'm not going to go for him. But all I can think of is that thing. <laughs> well, why wouldn't you go for him? Yes, well, I think it, there's a no, number of reasons why I might not go for him. I think he falls foul of a couple of them. I reckon That's there's it. one you could have a crack at, maybe. Yeah. I'm not going to go for him. I think I'll go for someone else. Any one of the other people out there. Yeah. Well, I guess it's an adjacent move, probably. Yeah. To Stephen Hawking. Ah. Professor Stephen Hawking. Debutante? Oh, well, I no, no. Too many times, but I... Andrew would know. Nah, let's not, let's not bother about Hawking. <laughs> as soon as he... Almost as soon as he is introduced. I'm going to go for Batfink. <laughs> Well, quite right, Zuhorn. Or no, I won't right. go for that thing. Uh, also, I think it, even more personally, quite right too. I think it's simply a case. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> of Charles Darwin. Hmm. I'm trying <coughs> to remember all the categories. 
Well, that's part of the game for sure. The, no, anyone that says that's not part of the game is living in fucking cloud cuckoo land. Yeah, blow the whistle. I'm just speaking my truth. Well, um, you know, it's a good atmosphere. An hour's gone, and would you oh. believe it? Did you win? Yeah, yeah, just about. Put it on your head. Bah! Bah! <laughs> and the joke. No, How do you stop a skunk from smelling? Uh, cut its nose off. Yeah, hold its nose. Both of you. Yeah. Yes, mate. That will keep you warm. Yes, mate. Is is right? Yeah. I don't think there's anything wrong with Charlie Darwin, but I might be wrong. Charlie, Charlie Darling. <laughs> Charlie D, here he comes. Charlie D, Charlie D, he did stuff about ecology. Charlie D, Charlie D, most famous for ecology. Charlie D, Charlie D, knew his way around biology. Charlie D, Charlie D, didn't exactly mind physics. <laughs> yeah, fine. <laughs> well, Sailing across the seven seas, old Charlie, Charlie D. D. Charlie, Charlie D. D. Born in 1803. I doubt it. Well, I'm going to involve Hawking. I know more people born ah. before Stephen Hawking. Oh, bloody hell. What? They've got to be born after Stephen Hawking was born. Well, that's pretty much what he implied, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, an, that's mega, Horn. I, I never knew you had that kind of move up your sleeve. Isn't there something like there's more people alive today than there's ever been alive? Ever or something like that. So, but some of them are ghosts. Yes, it makes sense. Oxford Street looked pretty busy today. Yeah, so that'll be why. <laughs> yeah, well, you can use any of those people on Oxford Street, <coughs> as long as they're, you know, as long as they don't rub stuff all the time. Oh, I wish I could say Will, but I can't, can I? Will. He was the person I played football with today, and footy addicts. Well, it depends. Was he Will? Was he famous? Uh, quite famous. Yeah. Well, maybe you can say him. Well, hang on a minute. All right, I'll have a, I'll have a challenge. Oh! <laughs> this, this is this is the same spirit as Horn's earlier challenge. It's very speculative. Well, it's taken as it's meant right to be. It, it's part of the game. I think we've all... I, I hate to keep using the phrase as part of the game. I, I think it's possible you'll get a self-portrait of Darwin because in the olden days, people used to have multiple yeah. skills, didn't they? Like well, they Definitely, for the record, no, re no record of that. In my arsenal, that um, that category. I, I don't think it's that likely, but the thing is, you used to get people that would do a poem and do a discovery and oh. do a science rule and do a painting, and maybe no, I, think it's, those I think that's the first... Um, this is the, the exciting passage of play we were hinting at. I, I tell you what, we yes. I'll tell you what, yes. Well, <clears throat> good news for you... Probably, I think he might have done lots of self-portraits. I don't. I don't think he will have done, and I'm not that. I've done not huge appetite to get you out either. But I just think my worry is that Charles Darwin was a dodo. The trouble is, the guy was a clever guy, and sometimes in the old days, clever guys did loads of stuff, like did made up some music and did a, also made a rowing boat. So it's worth a go, and it'll give some fun. I just think otherwise, someone down there is going to be saying, "Well, at least give him a go." They're on the old. No, I think this is a, this is a worry for me. I think, especially looking at the chicken head egg man. Yeah, but you never can tell anything from Keys. I'm just hoping he's going on the Charles Darwin ten facts page. That's the thing. Sometimes Keys' work can be quite sort of, uh, you know, it gets there quite slowly, doesn't it? I'm scared. Yeah. Well, I'm scared as well. <clears throat> I'm scared. I, might have I think head the horn. Self-portrait. You've got about 20 seconds. Oh, this person resides in Darwin. Oh, God. Someone's in Charles Darwin. <laughs> or, or Charles Darwin's eaten them. Well, that's the end of your time. Well, that is the end of your time, but... Is it the end of your crime? Tim, is it the end of my crime? Well, I don't know because it all depends. Ah. I mean, study for self-portrait as Charles Darwin. 
Well, no. Is there a picture of Charles Darwin? No. Well, I th I don't know. I mean, maybe he's like, I don't know what this guy's doing. Maybe he's taking, he's doing a self-portrait of himself as Charles Darwin. I don't know what he's doing. It sounds too bad for Horn here, and that's fine. Well, I don't know. It depends if he's making any sense over there with the chicken on his head. I well, uh, <laughs> 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 he's my next move. Don't worry about me. Um, I don't think I can find a self-portrait of Charles Darwin in the lot of time. Fair play. Well, I think that was a very good challenge. I think that, I think... It was worth a go, but I again, I got mixed feelings. I'm reasonably happy with with all three of us staying in. I think, yeah, yeah I th very I good guy. From basically a very good guy. I, we're all like not bad guys who like each other. I think. Well, if, if if yeah, good challenge. Yeah, but not worth not worth it in the end. And uh, one challenge down, both me and Alex Horn here. So a slight advantage to Key, the Key community. However, well, key to play, yeah, exactly. Is it me to play? It must be pretty soon, yeah, because it's. it's... Oh, I haven't been thinking of anything really recently. Well, it traditionally comes around after Horn. Your go. Well, what did Horn just say? What was your person, Horn? Uh, I genuinely can't remember. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't think you've said one. Well, it... well, I have because you just challenged him. So yeah. I said Darwin. Oh yeah, I remember what I said. He did. If you think about it, you've just done the work on my challenge. So, um, God, was that the was that the last one? Was yeah, it was, wasn't it? That was the last one. I reckon if you look back at my record, I always go out having challenged because then I don't don't listen to the category. <laughs> yeah, it's quite easy to do that. A failed challenge, and you don't you zone out a bit from the old. Yeah, so excited about doing a challenge. Yep, yep. Oldest problem in the world. Well, no, rabies, but. Yeah, well, I'm flat tyres. Rabies, flat tyres. Rabies, no flat tyres, and you, uh, you trip over. But apart from that, the oldest problem in the world. Who well... You that? Oh, sorry. Sorry, my bad. Christmas! King Kong. You can, yeah. Ken Hom. Ah, ha, ha. ha, ha. You got Ken Hom. Well, it sounds like it. Ken Hom. Well, you know, I mean, it's either Ken Hom or it's batting down the hatches. <laughs> <laughs> and I think I might be battening down the hatches. <laughs> Is that what that means? Oh, no. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I think I'm going for Prince George. Oh. Am I, I think I'm going to batten down the hatches because <clears throat> the thing is, you say you're Ken Holmes and then you're in a world of true blade. No. Ah. 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 No. Ah. Ah. Yeah, sorry, you took the words out of my mouth there. Well, actually, no. You, you left I'm at the level with you. I haven't got any, any categories in my brain. Whatsoever. No. I've not been doing very well. I can't remember any of them. <laughs> Quite like I've not been doing very well from you. <laughs> it's a possible <laughs> new catchphrase. <laughs> well, it is hard. To, this is the thing. It's the devilish thing about No More Jockeys. For those of you who are maybe new to it, it starts off and you've got a free choice of really anyone that's ever lived or not even lived. Anyone, anyone. And, and, and then very, very quickly, doesn't it, guys? You'll, you'll back me up here. It gets narrowed down to, you know, a much more limited selection of people. And that there is the rub. There's the rub, actually. Don't nod at your bookshelf. Because, <laughs> okay. because certainly, sorry, Tim. Will you challenge Prince George? You too. I, I, none has immediately sprung into my tiny brain. I've got a grasp of some of the categories in my tiny brain, but I, 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 I think... Uh, oh, there's a possible... But I... Mm, no. Nah, I wouldn't blame you at this point for batting down the hatches. I really wouldn't. Well, you know, can I ask a question? I, I, want, to, I want to ask a question. 
Genuine question, like genuine question. I've got someone else I've got. Okay, so maybe we can workshop this together. I don't mind, I've got someone else I've got. Sorry, mate? I've got someone else I've got. Yeah. Would you, say that's me in a live, would you say that's me in a live setting? You're hiding, you're hiding your Zoom world. That's what you do. You're hiding your square. You're a keyboard warrior, mate. Do you want to, do you want to play How Many Monkeys? Oh, hang on. Yep. I've got, should I get a banana? Uh, yeah, yeah. I, if you're playing I How Many Monkeys. Well, I've got no, a banana. Because I, I don't have one. Well, you uh, can't play How Many Monkeys in. But what if I send one through the screen? Oh, no, it doesn't work. It's just... It's just... I can eat an onion. I'll get you an onion. Yeah. No, I can get my own onion. Oh, okay. So you, I'll get a banana and you get an onion. Oh, and then, it's, well, then it's time for how many monkeys? Uh, I'm getting an onion, he's getting a banana, and you're, you know, just settling down with the old, uh, you know, the old, um, you know, dun dun, you know, the old dungeon dolls. Yeah, well, we're playing how many monkeys? Oh, yeah, of course. Shouldn't have said about the onion. I think you could have found a Darwin portrait. We got very lucky. Hello, mate. Um, because obviously it's not just about the challenge, it's about the success of the, it's about the, the, the um, efficacy mm. of the challenge of the worker, of the person doing the work. If it, I wonder if he'd, he'd have been asked to have drawn himself. I've got some good news, I've got some good news. Right, I've got some fruit here. Keep it out of sight of the camera. Ah. <sighs> Okay. Um. <laughs> well, is it how many monkeys first, or are you doing your one? No. It's how many monkeys, because my, my <laughs> one doesn't... Well, but I'll tell you what, coming up later... Oh, that's a quick glimpse there. Coming up later is... Uh... <laughs> In fact, shut your eyes, I'll just show the uh, the old dolls. <laughs> Pineapple! <laughs> well, you said it. <laughs> well, it was obvious. <laughs> 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 Go on then. Okay, well, I'll give you the first. <laughs> and then the question is, how many monkeys? <laughs> I'm going for... Uh, I'll go... For, I'm go, go big or go home. I'm going to go for 600. <laughs> so I feel like I can win this by just... <laughs> yeah, you just you either go one more or one less, don't you? Yeah, I'll go 599. <laughs> You're going 599, are you? Yeah, because then, less, yeah. then if, there's, if there's under that, then I'm closer than key. And it might not be the pretty way to win a game, but it'll okay. do it. Well, let's start counting the monkeys, shall we? One. Two. Uh, two. Wait, 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 when we get into the sort of 400s, will you? <laughs> you, might have to, you, know, you might want to open your skylight. <laughs> Three. Four. Oh, hello. It's still up for grabs here. Yeah? No, it's four on a duck. It's four on a duck, and that means, it, as I say, it's not pretty, but with 599, I'm just marginally closer than Kim. Good game, Matt. All right, who's Great going? Great go. <laughs> oh, has he, gone for, has he gone for baby George yet? He was pretty that close. Was sad, that was the saddest moment of my game so far. My pineapple tastes like chicken. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, he's got the thing that's gone off, and the other two things were... Well, it's a plate in the, in the style of a fruit. Anyway, any guesses? That's a kiwi. And the other thing is a lime. <laughs> I like your anyway. like fruit game. I like your fruit game, I think. <laughs> Paul, do you look relaxed? He does, actually. I can't, I can't remember <laughs> any of the categories. Of course you can't, but you might still win because we're all having a lovely time. Well, I've had a lovely you day. Yeah, that Christmas. I've had a lovely day and I've had a lovely morning and I've had a lovely um, evening. Yeah. Have you lent your tree against the wall or is it self-standing? Why do you have to pick on your mates every single night? Why do, do you allocate certain dates which are just for you to have spite? It just looks like it's sort of pushed up against the wall. And why do you have to pick on your mates uh, I'd, I would ask you in a certain light. Is it because I'm a clever guy? <laughs> I, I would ask you at a certain light. <laughs> well, 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 I mean, well, my song, I lost control of my song. Okay. Yeah, you, we, you can easily lose C of your S. I'm going to go for Prince. I'm worried. I'm worried. Well, Watto's going to take a challenge on this. Well, who are you going for? 
Pitch to us. Well, well, um, Jack Lazowski. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is it? All right. Is the uh well he does uh my question about the night. Uh-huh. I don't want to get embroiled in it now, but I want to just cover my bases here. What about if they do like some of their work at night and some of the work in the day? I think it was most, wasn't it? M- most, most of their work at night. Right, Jack Lazowski. No more people. Who, who, who? Oh, when you think about it, who, who, who? who, who. When, when you think about it, it. who, who, who? Oh, when you think about it, who, who, who? You got to think about it. it. You know. Yeah, uh, don't need to say anymore. They, you know, they work on a circuit. There's a circuit, and uh, yeah, you know, they travel around and they'll they'll do tournaments. <laughs> and do they help yeah. they have cues? And they snooker <laughs> players, basically. They wear waistcoats. <laughs> they they they. They're friends with Hazel Irvin, you know. The main thing just... is to try and sort of knock a ball in using another ball. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It's annoying to have to use the other ball, wouldn't it? Yeah, otherwise it'd be a piece of piss. But you could put them in there with your, with your hand. No, no more people who work on a circuit. Right. All right. That, that means... We know what that well, means. Well, no, I don't know yet, though. Can you tell me what it means? Well, there's a lot of different types of circuit out there. Yeah. Well, let's we, put all, this... we all work on the circuit, don't we? Well, yeah. We're oh. circuit comedians and we're MCs. We're people who say, now, calm down, please. It's time to welcome the first act. Oh, who is it? Who is it? Who is it? I don't know. I don't know. Who is it? What's that? It, um, no, it's good, actually. Felicity Ward. <laughs> Bring him on there! Yeah, I'm, we're grateful to have her. She's warming up for a big, a bigger gig. Okay, well, Chuck Lazowski, no more people who... Yeah, they, they're on a circuit. So, you know, they are on a circuit, which means, well, yeah. yeah. So the, it's like a, the, the whole merry-go-round. It's like um, the Grand Prix or something like that. The whole industry is somewhere, and then they transfer and they go somewhere else. You know, it's a circuit. Yeah, yeah. It's a circuit. Well, it's like a circus in some ways, you know. Yeah, I mean, you preach. Or, t- or a touring, what? Or a touring theatre Oh, company. sorry, it's something you can say preach these days if you're younger than me. Nice to hear it. <laughs> yeah, it means you agree with the thing. Preach, preach. Preach, preach. I you think... Look, I tell you you look like, Horn. When? Ro- I think you look like Rosanna Arquette. Yeah. From Roseanne? Uh, Arquette. No. His life. From True Romance. Well... Mm. Do you? Can I just have permission just to do the work on that? I'm not checking what my future questions will be. Okay. I just want to just check. Right. No, of course you can do that. That's fine. Well, it's good to know who I f- finally know who I look like. I'm glad it's not. Um... Oh, it's Patricia Arquette. Oh, it. from um, Hyacinth Bouquet. N- no. I think it would have worked better if if she had pink hair in the film but you know you get the idea nice thing yeah, to say that, that would completely do that will absolutely do <laughs> i guess i'll take that yeah you should yeah. take that i'm quite i'm quite pretty um who do i look like then guys anyway patricia well, patricia raquette and Same. actually the old uh you know the old, the old dogs of war feel feel free to like put in the chat box who you think i look like the dogs of war will have their opinions they always do they always will it's what they do but no but nice things, like think of nice things I might look like or nice people I might look like. Like a panettone, for example. I don't look like a panettone. You do. I've just said you look like someone I actually fancy. Well, exactly. I look like a panettone. I don't know. Fancy a panettone is very different from fancying someone from True Romance. <laughs> There's a similar word, but it's not exactly the same meaning. Look, Ooh, I'm not no. challenging on Jack with, with Wilhowski. But I do think they do a hint of rubbing. 
I thought of this as well. They do. They. Um, I. They. I also thought of it. But you rub your cue and you chalk, but it's not. I think must be another thing, word for it. What? What's it? It's polishing. Chalking. But it's called chalking. Yeah. Chalking. It's chalking. It's not rubbing. It's the opposite of rubbing. I'd say it's the ge genuinely. I honestly think that's the opposite of rubbing. When you're rubbing, you are removing stuff to create a smoother empire. Now, with like when you do a brass rubbing, isn't it? You're rubbing off the brass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. And that. Right. And then with with, with chalking, yeah. what you're doing is you're adding chalk. You're adding another in ingredient onto your stick. What, what yep. does it go on? What is the, what's the nib made of? Is it cloth? <laughs> the tip is a... Is it pieces of cloth? What, the tip wicker? of the cloth? Is it wicker? Toffee? Felt? Bits of bread? It can't be bread. Rubber? It can't be bread. We'd know. Bread would make it, a lovely it, noise, it, though. Is it Coke? Oh. Is it made of, like, Coke? But standard Coke. Would it? Would it be? Hmm. <laughs> I well, I, I tell you what I, what I genuinely think is it's a very nice atmosphere. And also, it's just a nice atmosphere, you know, below the line, above the line. Everyone's oh, just... up here, down there. Everyone's having a fucking whale of a time. And that's why, you know, that's why we do what we do. I wonder if I'd still be doing the monkeys if it was 600. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah you probably would be. I thought you meant sort of if, if, if there were 600 in the audience. We more than that, which makes you think, isn't it? Uh, well, it's difficult now, and there's been a lot of categories. I mean, oh, sorry, it's, it's difficult now, and there's been a lot of categories. Yes, yes. I, well, yeah, no argument from me on that front, I must say, Mark. I don't think there can be any argument. Look, no argument. We're, we're all still in there fighting away. Yeah, we're all scrapping away like maniacs, aren't we? Really, um, sort of time where you don't mind slipping away. <laughs> well, we've, got, yeah, we've all had a good innings, and now, and now it's the uh, well. I wouldn't it, mind just walking into the sea at this point and not no, coming back. I, no. I don't, I don't know. I, I mean, yeah, I, of course, but I think what I might have just, I think I might just be able to um, perceive a slight, the slightest element of a game face. Well, what I think, what I do think is, yeah, if you go at this point, you go, you've you've had an honourable evening, but what you don't yeah. want to do is is throw it away. You want to you want to feel as if feel as if you're in the mix to win the bloody game. Well, feel as if you're in the mix to uh, cement your fame. And yeah, what's difficult is there's at least one category. Make yourself a name. What Tim, do your flatmates mind when you do all this singing? Your ten flatmates. It's half and half, really. Five of them absolutely hate it, but the other five are very chill. <laughs> okay. Is hmm. it touching? Is it touching the curtains? Oh, horn! I don't like your mind games any more than I like your family. I must say. <laughs> You like it less than, like, less than, less than, you, hi. <laughs> you like him less. You like him less. Hi, hi, hi. Less than... hi to everyone. I mean that sincerely. I do have one Robin mince pie left, actually. I might put it in the oven. Oh, oh sorry, coming up. Coming up, I'm going to eat a Robin mince pie, and I'm going to put it in the oven. Oh, I've got one, but it's from about a week ago. But how long can you, it's worth a go, is it? Stick it in the microwave? But no, I reckon the oven will just, it will, it will hide a multitude of sins. Mouth closed, yeah. please, Horn. Is it iced? No, no, this one's from uh, Condator and Cook. No offence. We have very different frames of reference. I didn't buy it from there. Do you know what I'm going to get my nephew? Do you know what I'm going to get my nephew for Christmas, Horn? We're all ears. Well, I, you say Horn as if I'm not interested in this. Well, oh. you... <laughs> I think you might be interested, actually, Watto, because you've got a little boy yourself. Yeah. What are you getting for Christmas? The boy? Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I don't think he's watching, but uh, a, a games console, a, a, you know. That's cool. Thanks. I'm, I'm getting my nephew, um, well, amazing, really, to even say it out loud, but rope. He wants rope. He's gone for rope in the end. <laughs> Rope. Rope. What? How old is he? Uh, one. 
Yeah, there's no, fair there's enough. no point getting condoms or anything like that. No, of course not. What? What the fuck? I well, don't know. Too young. That. Too young for all that. Uh, well, I imagine so. What the fuck are you talking about? Condoms. <laughs> well, I'm just saying, too young. For, too young. Are you, are you blowing, ah, okay. Throwing it on me. That was you blowing that. I'm getting the booking. Well, at some point, as an uncle, you've got to introduce the idea of being safe. And Christmas yeah, time. Yeah, and it's rope. This guy is this guy's fifteen. This guy is interested in climbing trees. Are you fifteen now? Yeah. He's aging very quickly. I, I, I haven't finished saying his age. I was going to say five. Well, <laughs> I would say get him rope and some condoms. I forgot that's how you say numbers. You say them one digit at a time. Oh, I swear to God, I'm not getting my nephew Johnny's. If you if if on Christmas Day he opened up rope and some condoms. What would John say? John would love it, wouldn't he? I tell you what, how about we put it another way? I've got Mert Ak, I think it's time for Mert Aksak. Well, thank you very much. And before you say your category, I've thought of a lovely new present for my god for my godson. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's promoting safe sex. It's promoting no. sex. I That's don't think it's relegating self sex. It's getting sex into his head. You're you're, oh, you're insane on. If your nephew impregnates someone in the next month, you'll be gutted. Yeah. Sorry, but it is. That was huge, Div. <laughs> if we let that go, we wouldn't. There's no point in having the bigger thing. I want a Perrier. I want a Perrier. I want a Perrier. <laughs> well, I... that's a good atmosphere, isn't it? It, that's the thing and I don't know I mean maybe this is but I think at this point when your brain is in this sort of state what most people do is reach for really, the, most, the most famous person in Nermal Jock is Mert Aksak yeah you think the Perrier's become the Iffies didn't they yeah they briefly became the If Comedy Awards and they tried to get it going as the Iffies but well, it, it could have been called the Big If shouldn't they that would have been brilliant it didn't work Yes, if, if it was now, it'd be the big if. Big it was like when someone tries to get a nickname going up at school, but no one uh, goes for it. <laughs> well, I can't think of enough of the categories for this to really, but, yeah, you know, I, I think you've certainly got a chance with Mert Aksak for the usual well, bit, the good thing about Mert Aksak is, at the very least, he's, he's always has been and always will be invisible on the internet. Yes, yeah. he's, he's, there's nothing, there's, we don't know anything about him and we never will. We don't want <laughs> Until until such a time as we have Mert Aksak's phone number where we can just check some stuff with him. I still think Mert Aksak might just be a like OPEC. Lembit OPEC? No, like a collection of countries. I'm not sure it's a person. How's your point going on? No, I I lost interest in myself. <laughs> but I thought I you can't. I have a period of life like that. Mert Aksak, I think. I think. I think. I think I'm thinking of Anzac. Am I thinking of Anzac? Yeah, ANZAC is stands for Australia and New Zealand, and it's yeah. the, it was the name given to the combined military forces of those guys. Now you're still used by sporting teams sometimes. Well, uh, sometimes the Aussies come over and they um, they go and have a little look around Gallipoli, don't they? They have an ANZAC day where they remember they're dead. Yes, they're not all well, dead. I, had, I remembered they're alive, as in I went to the uh, MCG and watched the Aussie rules. And so did I. And yeah, it's Mert Oh, Mert Axak. What a rancid pineapple we have before us. No more. I don't know if this is fair, actually, but. Oh. I, oh, is it? No, I don't think it is. No, I don't think you have that. I mean, I'm having him, but I don't think that's a good category. Mind you, it's quite late. We could do. All right. Shall I just throw a sort of throw a. Yeah, why not? And then maybe you'll challenge, but if you. Uh, Mert Aksak. No more people who. When you think about it. Think long and hard. Uh, no people who. Imagine we're all in, in the pub together and he walked big, in. Big imagine. Big imagine because of the restrictions which are coming. Are they? Um, yeah, I think so. I think it's I think it's more problemos. Um, no, no more, no more jockeys. Weirdly, that might be the one thing that sort of thrives. Actually, yeah, this is playing right into our tiny little online hands again. More no more jockeys. Yeah, no more no people that if we're all together and he walks in, none of us 
can definitely say it's him. None, no more people that none of us could definitively recognise if they were standing in front of us. Well, I'll put it this way. I'm glad I got Jimmy Riddle through when I did. <laughs> I forgot I, I, all about Jimmy Riddle. I enjoy that category because just I like that we're in a pub and Axe Axe in there too, but we haven't recognised him. Well, <laughs> I, 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 it's perfectly possible we've been in a pub and not recognised Axe Axe before now. It's not likely. Well, um, I enjoy, you know, a lot of stuff that I get up to. Um, squash? Squash? Yeah, I like squash, yeah. Um, you know, I've got a couple of typewriters. Yep. Uh, you know. Same. Yeah. Um, Horn, you, you, you seem happy enough? Yeah, I don't mind that people have pets. I think I think it's fine to sort of own an animal. If that's what you want and if you're going to look after it. Big if. Wow. Well, I got off with a 17 year old cat last week. You got off with a 17 year old cat? <laughs> he got off with it. What? Oh, by the way, Horn, you're mad. No, by the way, is no one challenging that? Because if they're not, I'll just go and get a bit more wine and have a like little breathe. Well, I would if I could remember any of the categories. But well, you can't remember any of. And look how much of it there is. Ooh, I think I just saw <laughs> everything. <laughs> you see everything. I think I saw it. It was quite wide. What's yours look like, honestly, Horn? Like a s squirrel. Yeah. In every way. Yeah. Ferreting around. Mine looks like a lat flow test. You know, the... Um... The sticks. <laughs> the whole lot. No, the box. Right, is it my go? I, I'm not. I'm, I'm not on. This guy. Yeah. This guy. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not on to call it a lat flow yet. I'm still on lateral flow. Oh God. I've, I've done LFT. That, no one. It's not mine. Yeah. I did seven. No. Seven. Seven. All positive. The last one melted through the coffee table. Yeah. I don't know. You tell me. I'll go for Jesse from Toy Story. Pardon uh, me who? Pardon me who? Pardon me who today? Pardon me who? Pardon me who? Pardon me who, pardon me who, pardon who today? Me who. Jesse, the cowgirl from Toy Story. Yeah, the cowgirl. Well, mate, you mind up. Cowgirl. The cowgirl. Hmm. Jesse, I don't know this person very well. Well, I don't know her very well, but I also don't know Mert Aksak very well. Yet. You know Jesse. She sings a, a haunting song at some point because she's sad. When somebody loved me, everything was beautiful. Oh, every hour spent to get is it that one? It's that one, yeah. Wouldn't it be it amazing in my heart heart when she loved me? Dong, 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 dong. Yeah, it would be great if we were talented, wouldn't it? And that, and but so Gosh. Horn just that, but he's like Tim Minchin or Hugh Laurie or something. Uh. Very nice. Because I'm a bit like some Dudley Moore, but yeah, actually, we haven't got any talent between us. We're no, we're just doing this. Not yet. Not yet. But we're working on developing some. No more. Picking Through the, the summer and the fall, we had each other. That was all. It goes up a key. Oh, who <laughs> do you us together? Us. Okay. Who do you get at Christmas? Christmas. <laughs> no more pictures of pigtails in ninety seconds. You get Cliff Richard. You get a pilchard. You get a lot of friends. <laughs> I, go, oh, I lost the song. You get the Edmonds. You get their Edmonds. You get other people who've had some problems. <laughs> right. No more. No, you can't picture them with pig. You can't get a picture of them with pigtails. No, you can picture them with pigtails, but you can't get a picture of them with pigtails. With pigtails. I know you've only just finished saying it, but I'd love you to say the category again, old B. <laughs> and I was thinking that even halfway through you were saying it. You can't. I just couldn't seconds. engage. I couldn't climb on. You can't find a picture of them with pigtails in ninety seconds. And when she was sad, I was there to dry her tears. And I knew <laughs> that she loved me. Uh, are you going to challenge, or can I go for a wee Willy Winkle? Hmm, I can't think of anything because it's difficult. With with, I mean, I also yeah. 
I'm on my way out here, Horn. Go for a wee willy dubs. <clears throat> <clears throat> we're all on our way out here. We're all we've pushed each other. We push each other hard in this game. This I is reckon the game for the faint-hearted. If you are one of the downstairs Dumbledores, go for a wee as well. Yeah, this oh, is brilliant, a brilliant. great opportunity. He's opened the door to the toilet. That's, that, let's open the door to the toilet and see a salute. I'm not going anywhere. No, man. I will say, Tim. Horn's been a bit more together in this game, hasn't he? We've we've had some worries about him in recent times. Horn recently, and I will actually, I'm going to make the most of this whistle not being, you know, flouted around. But Horn's been playing like an absolute fucking horse cunt for about, well, probably, I'd say it's somewhere between eight and ten months. I'd say it's it's the whole, 2021 has been a year to forget for this great of the game. It's been Fair. a sh- year for Horn and all his associates. And if you're one of these people in the old, you know, cubicles, who is, who is you know, barracking for Horn, you need your fucking head red. However, tonight, there's a slight return from Horn, and I'm interested. Tonight, Horn has just shown a few inklings that he's not, a, as you say, a complete horse gun. Well, he's not a complete horse gun. He's, you know, he's bucked his like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <clears throat> he's got a pineapple. Apple. On his arm. Okay. What did I miss? Nothing. No, no. Now it's old soldier. Oh, yeah, sorry. Now it's old soldier. <laughs> All right, then. It has to be done. And there's no real... There's no real option, I'm afraid. Mm. Well, that's why, however many regrets you might feel... The following must be said, and it must be said loud, and it must be said clear. And it must and be it conveyed said, to everyone listening. <laughs> well, it must be said loud, it must be said clear. And it must it be must conveyed to everyone listening. Oh, yes. Is so, this your last uh, one? Oh, sorry, Tim. No. Is this your last one? Yeah, you're wrapping, we're wrapping up. Wrapping up. Oh. I had Judy Finnegan's son on stage with me the other day. Anyway, it must be said loud, and it must be said clear, and it must be said without a scintilla of fear. It's Desert Orchid. I've That's... never met the Queen. I've never met the Queen. I've never, <laughs> never met the Queen because I'm a horse. I'm a horse, so it couldn't have been a reality for me to meet the Queen. <laughs> Interesting. Now. Desert Orchid. Interesting. Desio. She's not walking into a pub. Let's start with that. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a big walk into a pub. <laughs> I mean, she's not, because there's not a circumstance where she does. I didn't know it was a she. I thought it was a he. Well, I think it's a he. Oh, well, you kept saying she. Uh, I can't remember. I, I rode a horse last summer, and the amazing wait, wait, thing wait, is wait, that... wait, wait, wait. Oh. I think finish off the fi- the Finnegan anecdote, and then we'll get on to you riding a horse last summer. Yeah, just because oh, well, some of well, us. I, I feel like the one I'm on is the is the horse anecdote, and it's pretty short. It's just there's something called horse flies, and they just land on this things on this horses. Yeah, no, boy. boy. See <clears throat> no, what? No, uh, no, uh, horse flies. And then land on the horse's boy, and then the, you know, the helper or the people who brought the horse to us, they're slapping the horse's boy. <laughs> the helper, the helper is slapping the horse's boy in Tim's anecdote. If you've just tuned in, <laughs> right? And Finnegan's son. Well, he's just a guy out on stage, you know. And I just asked him his job, and he said, you know, Judy Finnegan's son. Basically, yeah. Main job, main job. <laughs> well, was, I don't it, know. was it? Richard. Yeah, he's about sort of 60. Yeah, that'll be Richard Maidley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Richard Maidley, he said he's the presenter. Yeah, yeah that'll be Richard Maidley. Maidley. I forget yeah. they're a mother and son duo. <laughs> it's easy to forget. <laughs> it, please, it's Richard Maidley. <laughs> up, down, up, down, Richard Maidley. Okay, I've had enough of all this. <laughs> Ah, good night. And I'm going to say, um, Desert Orchid. Well, I suppose no more people do without normal feet. You know, like a human feet. So, (laughs) you know, everyone now has to have feet. (laughs) Yeah. How How many feet? 
as many as you like, but they've got to be human feet. Right, and this is going to sound stupid. Does a centipede have human feet? Goodness me. Does a centipede have feet? Does a centipede have <laughs> Does it have normal feet? <laughs> oh, does it have the ones that humans have? Or should I go on the retreat? Does a centipede have... So you just think, are you weighing up a centipede as your move? Yeah, the enormous centipede. Not no, no, I wouldn't I don't do it. Hold, don't do it yourself. Anyway, there, there I am, you know, sitting sitting on my sofa, and I've come up with Desert Awkward no more. It's not Desert Awkward, is it? <laughs> I did it awkward, a bad name for a horse. I must have you made it a bit Desert Awkward. <laughs> you can name the horse Desert Awkward. <laughs> That's a tribute. Desert, I don't think I don't think the horses organise themselves into tribute bands of famous horses. I think that's very much part of the sort of human culture. Yeah, I don't think horses do sort of parodies, do they? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I'll I'll do I'll do a challenge. Um, isn't that working on a circuit? You 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 race in different in different places around the country, around the world, in much the same way that a snooker player. Plays ah. in tournaments around. I was thinking of doing this challenge, and it's well, very enjoyable to watch Tim's expression. I think I just, no, 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 no. I, I, I think I made it quite clear that the circuit is like they all sort of they do it, and then they all get up and they all go to the next one. Whereas horses is much more; they're all just sort of all over the country all the time. Well, yeah, on the circuit, on the horse race. Okay. Do you want me to have a like, race horse circuit? Is a big thing. I wouldn't mind if you looked at it. <laughs> No, well, well, I don't know. You tell me. Well, I mean, stands on me, isn't it? If I walk, I walk. Of course, again, you won't. But I just, I still think. Well, it, I, well I, I, no, 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 no. But only because uh, all, all I would say is this: I'm talking about creatures who are they're all together, and then they all, and it's mad that they finish the tournament, and then they all see each other next week. But I yeah. think that, that, so that is all... only only snooker players. Then, yeah, like well, the com I'm on the comedy circuit, but. We all are, but sometimes you, you see people not for six months, but then you see them again in another situation, and that's quite a bit like being a racehorse, isn't it? Well, um, <clears throat> I think you do yourself a disservice. <laughs> I, I, I'm talking about tennis players. You know, the fact that these are Grand Prix, you know, where the Grand Prix, they just go from one event to the next. Yeah, I, yeah, I understand. Yeah, like, all, I think sometimes together. the circuit can can it doesn't necessarily mean everyone. Yeah, there's about know. there's about sixty race courses on the, on the on the horse racing circuit. Yeah, well, I, I, I think, in my opinion, this is just my opinion. Desert Orchid is going on a series of individual standalone business trips. <laughs> <laughs> like he's not he's not part of like this, they're not going in convoy from you know. <laughs> So are we? Are you making clear that because you came up with the uh, category? So, comedian, <laughs> yeah. so comedians yeah, I, are not I, on the circuit. I, I think I know my category more than you two, chums. I must say. Yeah, the so comedians are not on a circuit because they don't mm. all get up together at the end. Which is my point, really. That's quite a lot of like horse race. <laughs> yeah, uh, well, I totally agree with that. But I, I was using as my um, starting circuit a different type of circuit. I'm delighted with standard and business trips. I must say. Well, I, I do. I genuinely think they are business trips. I think it's like. It, 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 you know, it, do you know what I mean? Anyway, you know, the fact is, um, he's he's retired. <laughs> <laughs> or died. No, you know, nature's retirement. He's Either probably way. he's probably nature's retired by now. I reckon. Yeah. So you're still you're staying put. Well, I had thought of that category, and I thought I think I'm okay because, in, <laughs> in my mind, the, the 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 circuit the circuit lifestyle I'm talking about. <laughs> is is Kafelnikov and Hewitt, and they're going well. Fantastic! We've just done Milan, and it's very much a case of we're all on similar planes, and we're going right. to Dubai. Why and don't we'll you? See you, and we'll see you there next week we'll for we'll another little entry. Then we, we've done Epsom. We'll see you at entry. No, that's what I'm saying. Is that that they are going? There, it's much more crisscross and scattergun. Red, <laughs> um, red. Red, red awkward wouldn't see the other horses you know he's, he's running about you know he's probably running about sort of seven or eight times a year I don't know the actual ins and outs of it but <laughs> I think I'm I think I'm pretty good yeah well shall I shall I do a challenge just for fun 
He yeah, might as well, because uh, it, where Keith's concerned, it is often just for fun, really, doing the challenge. Well, uh, to be fair, um, well, this is what's known in the game as me milking your challenges. Yeah, well, <laughs> let, let's let's get down to zero challenges as well. Uh, I'll go for he had a muscly body. <laughs> yeah, I don't think of I don't think that's impossible to. I imagine it's all muscle. Yeah, um, that is night night nurse. Well, <laughs> I'm afraid the guy was fucking ripped. Oh, I was not. I was not expecting you to um, take off the chicken. Well, all he did was fucking get his. The guy was muscly. The guy was oh, as muscly as all hell. My muscly legs mainly. Now <laughs> he's put, you don't he have to walk on this. He didn't have a six pack, did he? Oh, I, the chicken is back on his head. Uh, well, well, Watto, what do you walk on this? Just, just to give me a steer. Muscly body? I think it's a really clever challenge. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, actually, Tim, but I do think that racehorse is definitely, they're not exactly under-muscled. Yeah. I, I mean, you, might, you might just look like any other horse. Like, if you walk past him, would you go, wow, that's a lot of muscle? That mm. oh, was, right. It was meant to be exceptionally muscly. So, I, I think... I think Watto should find a picture of Desert Orchid. If he looks just like another horse. Yeah, do the work. Seriously. I'll well, do the work, but I, I think... Desert, or Desert Orchid um, muscly and let's see who salutes. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I, it wasn't going to be a chase you out of the paddock challenge. But I think you might be being chased out of the paddock. I mean, one, one plus one is two. I suppose that much I do agree with, yeah. Uh... I mean, and, and, and when all I, I think it's really unlikely that any picture of him will make him look more muscly than any other race. Well, have you found any without with, with his top off? I mean, he looks muscly as fuck in these pictures, but it's it's whether. Well, I look. I don't exactly look fucking flabby in my pictures. I'm. I'm. I'm but that, that uh, it's whether or not. Well, there's any muscle. number of pictures where he's got like very clearly defined muscles, but I, I don't know if you like. You know, um, whoa, kitchen conversions. Oh, yeah. And in fact, although it's an amazing time to do it, we've got to play round two. So, <laughs> ah. 190 Celsius. What's that in Fahrenheit? And that's to Alex. I, yeah, I've got this one. Yep. Okay. I don't know. Okay. And then 24 ounces, but in metric, Tim. Can I, have a, can, I have a, can I have a swing at it? Yeah. Don't know. And so it's nil-nil, and we've had two rounds of kitchen conversions. It is tight today. It's a good old... It's it's a real... What's spin. my butt, cunt? <laughs> Your butt can come down here. Right, 10 to midnight. Okay. Well, well we, in a way, 10 to midnight, because... Yeah, I mean, what are we going to do here? We, we, are we, uh, is Key's, is Key back on here? Key, with enormous dignity, has removed his chicken. Unbelievable. On, on the basis that awkward is muscly. Well, it's a very honourable play. I, I, but I, I, I think he's sort of right. I think it's very, I don't think you can say he's musclier than any other racehorse, but yeah, it's a very good challenge, I think. I might, do you know what I might do? No. I might get might get a beer from the fridge and put a um, put a mince pie in the oven and put a, a, a Christmas pudding on my head. I, I'm exactly blaming you. Yeah, I th put your head in the oven, put the mince pie on the... Uh, on well, the I don't think I'm going to get my plath on just yet, Hornio. <laughs> well, I almost feel bad now that it's a, it's a very honourable walk. I know, but it was a really good challenge because I'd forgotten the muscly thing. But I mean, you, I do think a racehorse is 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 packing. A yeah, they probably are. and I guess it's probably more muscly than a human. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that was honourable by Key, but then that's sort of that's the guy he is. The, the last thing you'll see from Key is walking away from challenges. You yeah, know. and but I would have said the circuit challenge was better than the muscly. <laughs> Well, I suppose sometimes you have, it takes two key two key challenges to get a normal a normal person out. <laughs> Between us, I think we had half a point each, and then maybe that's enough. So yeah, now it's, yeah, it's me and thee. And it, was, it was the cumulative takedown that did it. I think. So, so what have you got? No challenges left. No, I do not have any challenges left because uh -huh. mine was upheld. Just, just the one. 
But you feel that this stage of the game, there's not very much of it left, probably. You know, this is like, I mean. This is, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is the final throws. This is the two of the founding fathers going head to head. Let's have a look. Yeah. No, you're right. He is. Two, I would say, my favorite, my, probably my favorite players. Two, two of your sort of um, heroes? Two of my peers, certainly. Certainly, two of your contemporaries. I mean, well, nice to know that you can have hooves, though. Oh, yeah. I don't half like the look of you with that wig on the horn. That's brilliant. Yeah, no, you've made that clear. Oh, hang on. Yeah, we, so the thing about human feet is no longer a thing. Mm. Are you only going to be looking at me now, Tim? Oh, look at Mark as well. So it'd be the two of you, yeah. Mark. Mark. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And well, I got that as well. I'm like, I'm Tim. Hello, Tim. Hi, Mark. It's, it's fucking bonkers, but you know, we are where we are. I just got... don't understand how the tree is it sort of two dimensional? Why are you not further into the room if you're in front of the tree? Yeah, it's interesting. Is it a you... flat tree? No. No, I've got a, quite a plump tree, in fact, people have commented. Well, it's plump that way. Is it well, stabbing I'm... you in the back? No, one of the few things not to, actually. Loads and loads of categories now. It is difficult, but... I mean... I started the game with high hopes. I started the game with high hopes. And now look at me, before my tree. <laughs> but one thing I don't do is mopes. That's not, mm, yeah, very nice. Pretty much fine. There must have been a way of getting mopes in there without it being grammatically wrong. I started the day with high hope. Hi. I started the oh, day hi. with high hope. And now hi. look at me, in front of my tree. But mine is not to mope. Yeah, that's nice. Mm, yeah, but then you've gone wrong with high hope at the beginning. I think that's the problem there. I, I, started the day feeling joyous. I started the day feeling joyous. And now look at me with my tinsel e tree. Oh, well, look at me, guys. I am joyous. <laughs> no, I think you'd have gone to not joyous, wouldn't you? <laughs> well, I don't that... like the hope. I don't like to mope at all. I'm now alive. Look at me. I'm standing very tall. I'm a little boy. You're my favourite man. One, 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 two. <laughs> it's better not to mope. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, I, okay, I've enjoyed everything immensely. And I think that down there in, oh, the, in this mate's bit of top, Yeah, it's a good atmosphere. It's a happy camp down there, I think. Yeah. I do think. It's a really nice atmosphere. <clears throat> to put it mildly. Do you know what I love? Ah. Yeah. Taiwan! Oh, yeah, it's been a while, actually. But I've, yeah. <laughs> now, I'm just trying to think if I... Um... Like, probably, like. But... Yeah, I'm not sure if there's a country I love. Really? You always seem to be quite into Egypt when that comes up. I love Egypt. Yeah, I could love Egypt. <laughs> Oh, yeah, very good. Pray. They like to pray. Oh, this is great <laughs> Egyptian stuff for me. I hope no one down there says it's racist because I think it's been really good. Well, you walk like an Egyptian and they have the little uh, triangle tomb. <laughs> I think that one you're safe with. Well, is it a case of. I mean, God, we've got covered some ground in this one. Is it. Um, <clears throat> Oh dear me, there's been enough categories now. Enough categories. There's been enough categories. Do we just do I just go for Prince George? I'm sort of tempted. I don't know why Tim walked away from him. Well, because I just thought there was a, a nice a nice Lazowski option. Oh, that's right. It was, it was about a Lazowski opening. I think I might go for it. And if you, Horn, can remember any reason why I can't have this guy, then absolutely fair play to you because you know, <laughs> I mean, me and Tim were talking about this. You've not had the easiest 2021 in, in, in jockeys. You've had a good year professionally, of course, but, but in... A few, second, few second places, but not really been at the races. Well, I mean... You've struggled a bit. I, I don't know, Horn. I can't tell you how to play the game, but I'm looking at a Watson here who's 
nicely settled in. He's, he's playing very well now. He's batting down the hatches, you know. True. You know, well, I, there might be a good reason to not do this, but at this point, and with nearly two hours in, there's been a lot of categories. Yeah, sorry. And I just think... I think maybe I do... I don't know if I batten down the H's or not, really. I think I will get these up again, because that seems to have worked. Uh, sorry, I, 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 this one, I think you'd be mad to batten up the hatches. I mean, I, I feel like it's only the, the hatches are only going one way now. The hatches are going one way. It's Prince George. There's so many categories now, and, and both of us actually deserve, I think, and this is just my opinion, a lot of credit. Yeah. Maybe it's not a W. Maybe it's just a U each this time. It could be a U each. But for me, it's... I I, I think it's it's Prince George, and it's, it's as simple as no one that's had a kebab. Sorry, no one that's never had a kebab. No one that's never had a kebab. <laughs> They've how got old, a how old George? Sorry? How old is Prince George? I don't know, five or something. He hasn't, he hasn't he's not had the opportunity. But he might have he might have had the, you know, I mean he wouldn't have been lashed and got and gone to Kenneth Street, But there's a chance he might have um, you know, they might have gone, well, here's something that's sort of, you know, in that neck of the woods. Well, you, you, you... <laughs> Yeah, no, all right. Like, no, no, more people, no more people that have never had a margarita. Alco. Yeah. Yeah. Because I think you can pretty much be sure. I, I'd, I'd be so surprised if you had that. Yeah. He won't have had a margarita. The guy's a pussy. Well, it's to do with his age. Oh, so, yeah, and he's young. So you either have to prove they've never done it or they're just not possible that they would have had one yeah so a kid or a muslim i think maybe next time we should get a, get, get a game going of kid or muslim just to sort of, <laughs> it sounds like quite a good side game can i still do, do my egypt stuff in also the some muslims are of course moderate and might still drink so yeah the only way you can well, really be sure is a kid you do get sort of moderate kids as well who sort of will, will dabble a bit you do get moderate kids, or someone that lived long enough ago that um, they hadn't invented the margarita, of course, is another option. That's another way in. Anyway, all those people are out now. They've got to be able to have had one. I, I, I've got one potential challenge, but I think it's too risky. And how many have you got left? One. Yeah. I could, so I could do it. You could burn it. I think well, the old... I should at this stage. Well, it's late in the day. Well, I'm just, shall I do it? I, th I think it's stupid. I hope it's stupid. <coughs> well, I think the bug munchers would enjoy Oh, the bug munchers would fucking love it. They're hanging on every word here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If I'm it's, a bug it's muncher... A very, it's a very weak challenge. But sometimes a weak challenge becomes a peak challenge because of the uh, vagaries of this... Great game of ours. No more jockeys. All right, then, Keith. 90 seconds to see if you can find a picture of Prince George by Prince George. Yeah, no. I, I, I was, that was why I didn't play him earlier, was he's definitely done a self-portrait. It's whether or not you can find one. It is, it's, yeah, it's possible. Fair play. It is possible. I and just don't done. think they would have leaked it to the press, but it might have been like a... No, but he might have done a dog shit picture of himself at nursery school or something. There's, I and think that's so protective of all, of all that stuff. That's, that is what I was thinking. I think Prince George is handy because you can't get it much. It's done. It's, it's, it's in. I've got it. Um, oh. and, it's, and it's not bad either. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> to be keep fair, looking, that's decent. I had, I had really high hope then. I thought that I was done for then. The fuck? Are you joking? Well, whistle then. Look, look, look for the thing. Either way, I'm chopping up the drink. You, Key, you burn as much of this time as you want. This, by the way, this is one of the good live games, I think. This is two hours and this is decent. Well, Horn, give me some things to, to type. I mean, I'm. I'm, I'm... Oh, Horn, give me some things to bite. What's his name? Prince George draws a picture of himself. Prince George, artist. Artist? What the hell are you talking about? I don't know. Well, just pretend. Do something. I can't just pretend. Hang on a minute. He's drawn something here. Is it him? Um, 
He's not showing the right bit of paper. Hang on. Drawing by Prince George. And the time, by the way, is just sort of uh, uh, eking away. Dibbling out. Ways. Dibbling away. His secret talent... <clears throat> his secret talent... If it's anything else than that, I'm sitting back in my chair. Yeah, his secret talent is art. Ah. Mm. Any examples? Yeah. Right. Well, the time's up, so it's. He was, uh, he was, he was painting this picture at the at the polo match. It's another world, isn't it? Oh, it's another world. But unfortunately for you, Horn, it's not a picture of uh, desert awkward, is it? No, it's a picture of volcano awkward, as in a, a volcano erupting. That's him. Yeah. He's on the right or the left. The picture. No, I think I think this. Oh. You think that A4 bit of paper has drawn that kid? <laughs> no, I think Prince George has drawn that kid. He, Prince George has done a picture of Prince George a, holding a picture it, of a volcano. He's not penny fucking crayon, you moron. Yeah. I don't understand the reference. Yet. Hannibal <clears throat> Lecter. You're oh. in with Hannibal Lecter. Fucking oh, no, mate. We've got to keep going, haven't we? Well, we sort of have to. I'm not taking my gas off the pedal. Uh, that's a good sentence, I think. It's not bad. My mince pie that, uh... would be ready because I haven't put it in. My mince pie would be ready if I'd taken it out of the tin. I think I'm going to have nature's mince pie, I must admit. You're going for the toilet. Pizza crusts, John. I did a show with pizza crusts this year. No well, pizza. Horn, okay. it's not it's not a million miles off, but I think we, we maybe we'll give you it. But you, oh, you, we'll give it. To, you've got to do better moving forward. But I we'll think. give it for now. And, but that's so that's poor old stuff. I must admit. Ah, pizza slice. Pizza crust. Save our summer. Animal it's, not <laughs> it's not just pizza crusts. I've got a pizza slice as well. Oh, yeah, I did the show with him this summer. Now, who's that mean to be? Uh, I know someone called Peter Smith or some bullshit. Well, maybe, the, maybe the golf commentator, Peter Slice? Peter, yeah, Peter Alice. Peter Al Slice. <laughs> All right, I have all that. Is it? God almighty, there's been so many... No things. more definite baddies. If you're in the good... You're either a baddie or he's a baddie. Oh, God, yeah? Have you seen the film about him? Silence of the Lambs. Yeah, it doesn't exactly paint him in the most positive light I've ever seen anyone paint him. Christ almighty. He's incredibly rude to um, the character played by Jodie Foster. It's not just that. He's he's. It's not just that. He does stuff which... No, it's not just that. Well, he cuts off someone's, well, horrible phrase, face. I don't think I know why it's called The Silence of the Lambs. Have I, I don't think I've watched it. Yeah, because they weren't allowed to call it this awful fellow who eats people. Well, I think they were, the working title was "It's awful, but it's lawful." But it isn't lawful. But it's, it not, lawful. it's not lawful. <laughs> what's of it? I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> they, they didn't stick with that title. No, they were in the end. Okay, well, I mean, it's at this point. I mean, it's it's it, it is what it oh, is. Really? It's hmm, okay. I don't know what I can do with Hannibal Lecter because he, I mean, it's got to be a challenge, isn't there? By now, but by now, and I'm sure that down there in sort of uh, the Ganges down there, people will be saying this and that. But you, you want to try being one of these actual? Well, you want to try? Do you know what I mean, Tim? You want to try being one of us? Like walk right, a spend, mile and spend a day above the line. Spend a day. Spend a day above the line. Walk a mile in our shoes. Above, yeah, walk a day in our shoes. Spend yeah, a day above the line. Do you reckon any Taiwanese watching? They'll be loving it. Oh, they'll have had a great time, especially the first half an hour where Key wouldn't shut up about Taiwan. I love Taiwan. I love Egypt. What though? Any any countries you're sort of for more than against? I'm feeling funny about the Philippines. I think what it is is, and now this is difficult now, but hang on. So you've still got a, you've still got a, a challenge as well. No. No, oh, no, no, no. You, you just put it. So we're, we're both at a stage now where we're sort of, we're naked. 
I was hoping the prince had sketched himself. That's right, we're naked. So it's 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 death or glory, Watto. I'm not it, sure my kids have ever done a self-portrait. Yet. Uh, but sometimes what... you get that at school, don't you? But like I don't think it's a natural thing to do until you're a bit older. I think they only look out, don't they? They don't even look in the mirror. Oh, it's absolute gibberish, Horn. Not a criticism. I think if you... Uh, do you know a good amount that I think you should speak? About an eighth of what you're currently doing. If you if you, if you you move forward the next year with an eighth, I think mm. everyone would be very... I think you might see a difference in people's approach to you. Do I cut it down bit by bit or just stop at about 11? Every no, day? no. D- d- just don't say anything after February. Oh, I'll do it month by month. Yeah. Do it all normal until February and then that's and then... you. All right. Well... I mean, you know, I, I've heard what everyone's had to say and I have not stopped. I'd like to speak on my birthday. Well, then, then take a day off in January, mate. I've just had a great time. That, that's me. It's a really good atmosphere. Yeah, I think kind of. <laughs> You know, it's a really good atmosphere, is what I think. That's what I think. Any any news on your next next move, Watto? Well, I'm just actually thinking about it, Tim. I'm glad you brought it up. Um, I think... And, and, and that's a, a big thing. Oh, no, I can't have that. I can't have that because of a category, because of one of the um, categories. So, oh, I nearly right. went for some... What, 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 what? Maybe it'll be all right. The one you think. No, it wouldn't be because of the of the category, which you, you, I don't know if it's in your head, but it, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be fine. Um, so, well, no, can't have that either because Maybe. I got my dad a jumper. I get him one every year. Yeah, got, I'm a jumper every single year. I got gone. The trouble is. Difficult now because the. Well, what do you get your mum and dad just while he gets his cash resources? Uh, we don't do presents anymore like that. That's we nice. Do a secret Santa system where couples give each other. There's the four couples. We all give each other one present. Bite your hand off for that. Yeah, it works. Bite your hand off. So we, they Wait. actually gave me and Rachel a present, which was a meal in a pub. And we gave a present to uh, Chip and Ollie, which was some, a gin tasting night. Everyone walks away happy. Everyone walks away happy. And it's not a spoiler alert. We did Christmas two days ago. What? Did the Horn Christmas in a pub in Chiswick on Sunday. You've had your Christmas? Matt and Maury, sadly absent. Felix and Sylvie. <laughs> L lateral lat flow test. Laterally floozies. Well, I think, I think, I think. But Rachel makes the kids get the grandparents' presents, so they got socks. Hmm. Gull- Gulliver, is it? Gulliver. Is it? Nah, might as well be at this point. We've played for ages. <laughs> uh... Well, I enjoyed your story about all the gifts, or. I know I shouldn't have, but I enjoyed that. It was very nice. Oh, I think it was very boring. No, not for no, me though. We'll see when we when we look at the audience feedback. I think it was I'm very slag, boring. Slag right off for that. I think the Bronte and Gavin struggled with it because they didn't know any of the people in the story. Gulliver. Oh, sorry. Don't know. There's been a lot at this point. I think you got to try and do stuff like Gulliver and think. And you know, it's, 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 it's you know, isn't it? Well, no more, fi- no more. Oh, no, hang on. No, you, you can't really have that actually. That might be the closest anyone's come to finishing their go without not finishing their go. Yeah, but actually, if you think about it, it doesn't make sense. So, because. because it's obvious why not. There's, there's one category which it wouldn't be good enough. So there's no more travellers, wouldn't it? Sorry, we had no more travellers before. 
we had no more people that had been fucking enormous in one situation, but tiny in, in another. <laughs> yeah. So then <laughs> I'm amazed I actually went for him given that. Well, well I, think you, I think you do get swears. I think you also get blares. And I think I probably, oh, I can't have that either. So then, oh, it's just not that easy. You're tight for one. You're tight for one. I, I don't oh. think. I won. Yeah, and that's great, actually. And I, I'm really pleased. No, you're just quite tight for time. I, I reckon we want a name. I would say I'd get a horrible phrase, but relatively soon. Okay, well, I think what then in that case, what you can do is say. Yeah, exactly. It's not, it's not rocket science. You're in. It's not rocket science, but it's also not bucket science because it's quite difficult now. I, I think, like, oh no, you can't have that either. <laughs> There's loads of people you can't have because so many categories actually have have, have been um, have relaxed. I'll tell you what, some of the some of the water boys beneath the old um, plimsoll. Yeah, they the always plimsoll, right? some, of the, some of the cleverer ones think, yeah, this is the this is a problem. I've played the same amount of goes as you. Yeah. But like, I get penalised because I always have to start this fucking game. Well, well, that's yeah. Take that one, huh? Buy your pint next time I see you, huh? That's a promise. What did the horse okay. helper do? Uh, oh, she was whacking the horse flies off this uh, horse's boy. And that was it, was it for her? Can you can you stop saying was it? Well, no, he can't. He's doing that it. Was it? Was it? Was it? Yeah, that's you, you keep doing it. Okay, okay, okay. Um, Bro- Brooklyn Beckham? I don't know. Someone like that. Yeah, well, you can at least go for it. I mean, it's been... Do you know what I mean? It's been, eight. It's, it's been, eight. It's been eight. It seems like a long time since, even, since you were out, even. Well, that was the last go. I know. But that was ages ago now. I suppose so, yeah. But, yeah, in a way, yeah. I, well, I, hmm. I, Brooke, yeah, Brooke, you know Brooklyn Beckham? This, You know this guy? Y- yeah. David Beckham's son. Does he now play for Man United? That- no, you're thinking of um, Ronaldo. One of his sons has been signed. Oh, no, that's... Yeah. Wazzers, is it? One of one of Rooney's sons has been signed, yeah. Um, I know. Uh, it's, it's actually now, there's been so many categories and it's been such a great fun and it's it's time to say Brooklyn Beckham. It's been a great fun. It's been a great fun. No more people, you know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, no more people that have lived with a footballer. Here we go then. Well, I don't know. Oh, really? This I've, is. I've only got, I, I was interested, but I've only got two semi challenges. Yeah, and the thing is, semi challenges might not cut it in this dog eat dog world that we're now all living in. Or they might, because to be honest, I don't really know. I've got two eyes, but I've got no um... gonads. Horns had a rough year. No more jockeys, boys. I know, I know that. He needs a a big Sean Andre here. And he's he's it. And that's it. But I'm not sure I can prove. But if it's a small Sean Andre, then this guy walks out of the room and it's and he's got his blooming pin badge on and he goes home. He needs either a a solid challenge or he needs he's got something up his sleeve. If I'm horn at the moment, I'm having a good old think. I've said it. I'm going to enforce the clock because I would say what what my ambition is here is we can just say it's it's quarter past twelve. I didn't say ambition. I think people will, will be seeking assurances. We'll get we'll get the job done, but you know, in the next 10, 15 minutes. People would love people would love assurance. People will be seeking certain assurances. I've got three challenges up my sleeve, but I think you would not walk on any of them. Right, and you've only you, you can only pick one of them. Um 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 Al. Yeah. Is one of them stronger than the other two? Because you want to go with that one. I don't know if I know enough about Brooklyn Beckham. Uh, I'll tell you what, for one thing, I don't know very much about the guy. He just, he just, he offered himself, and I thought, fair play. I, I, 
I'm going to give you a shot here. I'm not allowed to ask, ask any questions about Brooklyn Beckham, am I? No. No, sir. Well, then I think I have to carry on. <sighs> what a game. I, I'll talk you through my working later on, then. I'll walk you through my turking later on. This is something. This is really something. Oh, yeah. Well, I feel like Key thinks there is definitely a challenge there. That's I think he's just taken a screenshot of something. There will is... be one. Key, Key doesn't think anything. Key doesn't say anything. Key isn't anything. Key isn't, <laughs> isn't anything. Key is just... All right, I'll go for Stephen Hawking then. Oh. <laughs> I think. I mean, there's definitely a possibility of some things. Blimey. I mean, it feels quite what, risque. What, what's the category, Big Bird? Well, let's go for no more uh, people who've been to university. <laughs> well, here it comes. I can't see I'm escaping without a challenge here, but then it's... No, but I, I feel like we're, we're, this is the point of the game, really, where the neutral wants a challenge and it's either yeah. one of us wins. Like that's, that's. I'll definitely talk through Brooklyn afterwards. Death or G? Yeah, death or G. So it's just about... I don't think he's exactly famous for rubbing things, so... Um... Oh, he's going through workings. He's, he's, he's <laughs> That's the thing. I didn't want to go through workings because I. Well, I'm only. I was only say that for fun because I mean the rubbings you feel is behind us now probably is a category. <laughs> Interesting. All right. I do think it's worth a challenge, and we just we see what happens, and someone wins and someone loses. This is going home time. Anyone down there in the gunk? Anyone flailing around in the gunk? Do not adjust your set. Do this, not go anywhere. This man here is going to challenge today. Charge your glasses, if anything. Uh, okay, well, for? well, okay. I mean... <coughs> he's, he, he's, had a, he's had a margarita. I, oh, the challenge is beautiful. Well, it doesn't matter now because because the, you know yeah. the, this is it. This is the end. Mm. Uh, so I mean, oh, hang on. What about? Oh no, you can't have that. Really work. Oh, there might well be. There's one you could go for, but yeah, there's one I think you'd go for, but then I don't know. If... There, there might be a definite. I don't know. It's too vague, I think. I, uh, all right, you can't have that. You can, hmm. oh, All right. When did the antlers go back on? Oh, just just a few minutes ago, I thought we're in antlers territory now. Yeah, yeah. I, um, I don't think you can really. You, you're not getting them in pigtails, and so I think probably. Uh, <laughs> Oh, I don't know. But let's do it. It, it. Maybe he's done a self-portrait. Maybe he has. Back to Darwin's land. It's, yeah, because... it's, well, what's good about this is it's it's beautiful. It's like well, it's nice. Because the, the thing is, the, when you're it's that famous, fun. when you're that famous, yeah. you'll often be approached by charities well, to, to well, do a picture. Uh, there's all Brooklyn. Don't yeah. worry about that, mate. Um, I thought that, but he's not. I thought he'd have a good body, but not a muscly body, Brooklyn. Yeah, it's good. That's what it is. I think it's good. I, uh, never mind that. Let, let's see, because, and, because I think that Horn is favourite here, but I just think maybe uh, you can get a because sometimes he must have had yeah. hobbies. He must have had hobbies. But also, you just, you know, if, if you're famous, you get asked to do a picture, and then they auction it for charity and stuff like that. So, and also, they would have kept it if he'd done it. They would have kept it. Yeah. 
I'll, I'll talk I'll talk you through Brooklyn in a minute. Well, I don't think I'm going to win on this challenge, but I do think, like, I think I, the game deserves this sort of death or G, I think. I, I, I think you're going to grin on this challenge. I mean... You're going to grin on it? Well, I mean, like, not win. Yeah. Oh, right. uh, you're all images. I mean, all of the portraits of him, it, it looks unlikely he's drawn them. Well... Um, Mm, there's some great portraits, you know, for, for anyone, you know, watching below the line. Was it, was, I can't remember, was it no great portraits? No, it was no self-portraits. It was. Well, that is the time, time. history. I, I can't find any evidence that he's cranked one out. Well, in that case, I have to crank one out and say that the winner is Alex Horn. <laughs> Against all odds. The the, the 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 massive outs and the ball is, the ball is on the ball is on the ball is on. <laughs> now he looks like Dim from uh, Clockwork Orange. Yeah, yeah, I'm actually. Well, I am him. Like him. That's well, fantastic. Well done, Horn. Well, like, uh, Horn, Horn, yeah, you need this. Horn, you've had a shocker of a 2021, but now this. Well, my problem with Brooklyn was if he walked into the pub, would you know it was him? No. But oh, I that, and then Margarita. But how old is he? I think he's old enough. He's definitely had Margos. But right. he's certainly old enough to, to, to have a lovely body. But whether it's definitely, you know, what we need is another question. I mean, we might need it. Oh, Ooh. it's not a bad bod. But it doesn't matter anymore because Horn has won it on that one. And it turns out not many people have done self portraits. But yeah. we've had so many cats by now. What are you going to do? We live in a world, we die in a world. We live I in think a world, and then we die in a world. It works what I mean, yeah. All, all we can do really is say, you know, the game's up. Adjust and your Horn, set. Is it adjust Horn, your sets? What, you can adjust your sets? Horn's won the game. Horn wins the game. And that's and, and Horn, who's had a, a torrid 2021 at times, jockeys-wise, wins the game. But I've but, been out, out of the running for some time, but I felt all right in this one. Yeah, you, you look, looked all look, right. <laughs> You were, you were you you looked like you were everything was suddenly starting to click. With you, you played the like, jockeys, I thought. That's what I thought. Yeah, well, I didn't take my gas off the pedal. Exactly. Well, I have to say this: we've had a lovely time. It's been a great atmosphere. I think now, so too. I'd say we have a lovely time, and it's been a great atmosphere. That's why. All as good players, you know, you can tune in on uh, Friday to Game Two of the um, No More Jockeys Christmas Specials. Christmas Specials. Fantastic set. Full of twists and turns. Mm -hmm. um, final one is the, the Friday after. I mean, it really does, you know, envelop Christmas such as this. Yeah. And, you know, we go again. We go again. Me, more online shows the rest of the week. Just, uh, we go again. I, I'd like to extend my goodbyes. It's time for you to extend your goodbyes. To, to all the guys and girls and in everybody the, else. Absolutely. In the, in the ball pit. Yeah. And the people above the line as well. Yes, that is. There's three really famous guys playing this. Very, um, all the guys. Thank you so much. And it might be a case of uh, is it handshakes all round? And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. Well done, Horn. Fantastic. Oh, well done.